Hello, 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 and welcome back to Goblins of Io. Oh, man. I shall be unmuting and talking to my fellow gob gobos and tortle as we shift over to here where nothing is going to break. Excellent. 15 hello, bucks to get hello. This, this like massive oh, yeah. game dev. Hello. <laughs> how y'all doing today? Hi, hi, hi. How are you? Hello. I'm doing good. I'm doing very good. I hi. am. Uh, I'm excited for today. As I am excited for every uh, goblin session. I yeah, was, yeah, there's probably some weeks <laughs> where you're just like, yeah, I'll phone it in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This no. is the way you fight the the guards or something. Yeah, this is three hours of guard fight. There, there's a lot of they keep calling for help and there's a barracks nearby. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know. Can we go to the barracks? No, no, no. There's no, a fire. It's fire there's away. a fire. Yeah, it's far enough away that you can't walk there, but close enough that the guards can get there from. Uh, the I I want to watch campaign. I want to watch a D and D where G uh, G Mart is the DM and he just phones it in every week. <laughs> just finds new ways to phone it in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were going to the catacombs today. Uh, I don't know. You're at the castle. Um, um, doors locked. It's like a um, lockdown. As an evil king. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta stop him. I mean, is there anything you guys want to do? Or... <laughs> yeah, we wanted to go to the catacombs, right? So the uh, evil yeah. king's in like the castle. He's at like the top or something. Mm -hmm. Go get him. <laughs> Absolutely. All right. I didn't finish the castle this week though, so I'll see you guys <laughs> next week. <laughs> <laughs> didn't even feel like the castle you're trying to keep them in. You're yeah. just like, yeah, it's but it's bad news is not done. Well, what about the catacombs? That's <laughs> extra oh, that's not done. done. You guys, yeah, you guys didn't want to go <laughs> no. there, so <laughs> that's extra not done. But we did want to go there. So so basically it's just uh phone unit in DM is just someone who gaslights their players all the time. Yeah, you didn't want to oh, go I'm to the playing, catacombs. I'm playing because I want to play the play. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to the castle. Yeah. <laughs> you guys want to go to the castle. Um yeah, I guess. I guess that's the only option we have. Alright. Um Crendor, are you uh are you in? I just want to make sure that you logged in. I thought I was, but I don't see anybody here. Uh, yeah, you're yeah, so you're you gotta close that and you gotta rejoin the link that I gave you. You gotta click that link. I don't see a link. You didn't give me any link. I sent you one via DM. Mm. Uh, I'm looking uh, at it right I like now. This conversation because oh, there it is. said, Crendor, I sent you a link to the D&D &D game and you said in roll 20, I still see the game. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it, it, yeah, you uh, you left the your window up, I guess, for like yeah. all week. So you were just your name was just there in all of the games. It made sense because I'd hear random like anvil noises <laughs> and I was like, what do I have open now? Oh, whatever. <laughs> what Good. the hell? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I had I had to kick you out once we were in a misdemeanor because it was like that's fair enough it pushing all the names up because you're like <laughs> crendorus maximus so all the names yeah. kept getting pushed up on the screen i was like i gotta kick I, remember, I remember summer used to be in a lot of games even yeah, if no. she was herself in a lot of games no 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 yeah summer's in a lot of games but she wouldn't leave herself but, locked but yeah, in yeah there was I, someone was always logged in <laughs> from that like was, a session before yeah 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 it happens it happens it's so it's, funny to me oh, yeah, yeah. Hey, I have windows up shit. I got a uh, let's see. I got seven notepads open right now because I haven't shut down my computer in like a, a week and a half. What windows is yeah, Windows is like you want to update to 11. I'm like get yeah, later tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow. Don't stop asking I me. I put off to windows 11. Up. On my I have one of those updates for literally months, and then yeah. it got mad at me and was like, "All right, no more fucking around. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You're obsolete." I'm, I'm waiting until Windows just pretty much goes. We restarted. <laughs> I was just like, "Ah, shit. All right. Well, okay." <laughs> I got Windows 11 on my laptop. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Is it just? Windows? I didn't want to put it on my main computer, so I got my laptop. Here's how I feel about most operating updates. They're mm. usually pretty good, except for if you use any kind of specialized software. <laughs> Yeah, like you're like, yeah, I'm just a guy who uses Microsoft Word for college. I love Microsoft or Windows 11. And yeah, you're like, yeah, yeah. it ruined yeah. my OBS and fucked up my microphone <laughs> yeah, setting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Shit just, on my yeah, premiere and this doesn't thing. launch and this game crashes. And yeah, like, you just push the update as long as because you're like, this update works. This works yeah, for me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, this, I literally this... I had a Windows update break my audio so that 
when my ripsaw captures my consoles, it does weird like like yeah, audio. That too. So I had to get I got Razer's THX Spatial Audio, which is a software you pay monthly. Mm -hmm. I got the free trial and I don't pay monthly <laughs> and I just don't turn off the free trial and I've just been using it for months. All right. So That's let me, I think I can, I think I can fix all of this right now. So I'm going to go. And every time I, I ended up buying their new video card, <laughs> I should probably or, uh, capture card. I should probably. And then, and then every time I restart the THX thing, software launches and goes like, Hey man, you finished up your 14 day friend. I just close it and it has no power over me. Ah, uh, 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 yes, WinRAR. I see. Yeah, it's like fucking yeah. WinZip. Oh, son of a gun. What the? You have no power here. All right, so I tried doing that and then at attributes and abilities. And it's saying I don't have that. No ability was found. What the heck? Macros work again? No, it does. Man, it just hates. It hates everybody. It's it's weird. Uh oh, that's Try why. Updating the Windows 11? No, it's oh weird. Hmm. I'm gonna hit him with that light. Oh, yeah, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> hold on, hold on one second. Oh, that's that's why it. Uh, I don't think it saved anyone's character sheet, which is unfortunate. Oh, uh, oh you know what? I bet you I know what happened. E. E nope, that's not it either. Weird. Okay, so that is what happened. Uh uh Summer said that she got all the character sheets working, and I guess they just looks like we hard didn't, uh, didn't broke save. Them. Yeah, goblins is ah, just geez. goblins is just Ooh. cursed when it comes to this. So yeah, uh D D yeah. beyond again, and I'll uh I'll work with Summer. Sorry, guys. Jokes on you. I always have both open. Hey, that's fine. I yeah! uh, I just have both open too. Yeah, I just can't I wait. I like the UI of D and D Beyond. I I, uh, I I like it as well. Um, although I get <laughs> no, it's it's whatever. I mean, as long as you guys are not losing your mind slash not having fun because shit's broken. That's where it is. Yeah, don't, maybe the sheets just weren't saved because I'm looking at everybody right now and it's like Skagzag still has the old sheet. I don't know. Again, we're all all Dude. we're doing. Oh, man, look at tomato. My shit works totally fine. I don't know what's wrong with wow, you guys. Who the hell are you? It's sort of sad. <laughs> like, come what? on. Like, you just click the button. No, um, uh, oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> you click the button. Hey, we're, we're I click Firebolt. We're, we're, it. Oh. we're literally building off like a, a shitty foundation uh yeah so wait yeah, like right spaghetti code yeah yeah hold on and then i've got what do you mean no abilities found i'm looking at your character shite ah! <laughs> okay whatever it's fine just maybe it's noah's abilities yeah maybe it's yeah <laughs> <Ew>. <laughs> nice <laughs> nice very good. That's okay. Uh, D and D Beyond as always. Smile. Okay. And then uh, Foundry looking pretty nice. Hey man, twenty twenty two is gonna be a hell of a year. It's for for IO and all the new games we're gonna be doing. Absolutely. Okay. Let us uh, resume. Uh, last we left off, all of the lovely goblins went over to uh, Chief Big Belly's Fort and Day Spa. Uh, where Clerk managed to talk their way through with prisoners uh, Qua the Tortle, or whatever name you gave <laughs> Qua at that point in time. He just kept calling himself Qua. Yeah, oh, that's right. He kept say. saying Qua. That's right. Uh, giant hyena and a warg. Um, after you guys ventured through the fort a little bit, without host hostilities, you guys managed to get through and talk your way just fine. You have finally arrived over at the uh, day spa section of the of the fort where you met with an old acquaintance uh mr happy himself along with uh clarence illegitimate son stink who Oof. seems to be just exactly he seemed to just be living his life as normal uh happy of course very apprehensive but after a conversation and a, and a share of stories uh happy felt some sympathy for you and i guess in a way sort of missed the uh the old goblin antics, seeing that you guys had been through quite a bit of a journey and a little bit of trauma along the way. Happy decided for one last show and, deci and decided to help you guys out, letting you know how to get through the fort 
letting you know where Chief Big Belly is located and uh, all that. So after a uh, distraction was set uh, with Happy bringing in Cheezle as a giant hyena, Pikel's warg, as well as Qua the Qua, you guys walked over and met with Princess Big Belly, who may have been trying to eat you guys. You're uncertain. But uh, after you smacked back uh, Princess, uh, or sorry, Princess Bigger Belly uh, at that point, and got into a very large rage, screaming and, and, and getting into a fit, which caused all the goblin guards in the area to uh, begin to, to try and see what the heck was going on. While that, um, while that mess was happening, the rest of the goblins came in to fight all the, re the remainder guards, chauffeurs, and ogres. Uh, there you met, uh, this is uh, apparently canon now, uh, an immortal goblin by the name of Vodka, who uh, was just the luckiest goblin in the world. And uh, after all was said and done, the battle was completed. Vodka the goblin was finally defeated. Uh, his corpse laying there down at the door. Uh, meanwhile, uh, while all that was going on... Uh, hey, I can't see anything. Uh, yep, hold on one sec. Because you're dead. Yeah, uh, yeah, give me one second. I, can, I, had to delete, I was deleting your token to try and fix it. So now, you should be able to see. Uh, yep, I, get, I can see. Excellent. Um, I'm also going to remove this. So yeah, while all that was going on, uh, Cheezle fought with his ex-girlfriend, Princess Bigger Belly, and I believe Qua was the one that did Polymorph, correct? In Do you think Cheezle could cast Polymorph? Well, I, I'm trying Please. to remember who was in the room. I believe it was just Qua yes, and Cheezle. Uh, and the so, warg. She yeah, and the warg. the warg. And uh, yeah, so Qua did a polymorph, uh, transforming Princess Bigger ah, Belly what? into a small. <laughs> what, what's Jesus up? Christ. You were just like transformed. It was it's like it was like <laughs> it's out of crazy. nowhere. It scared the. It was like when Bilbo <laughs> reached for the ring and was like, ah. <laughs> yeah, <it> was. <laughs> it the shit out was of me. that scary? That made me jump. I don't know what yeah. the hell that noise was. It shook me. What? Yeah. What noise are you talking? Okay, it must have been breath. It sounded like you went robot, but it, it was, was like, like randomly peak robot. It was like oh, peaking it peaks and robotic robot. at the same time, and then Yikes. it was only for a millisecond, and then you just went back yeah. to talking. Yeah. It was just like a. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, let me read, let me go, let me back up a little bit. Um, so, uh, Qua transformed Princess Bigger Belly into a tiny mouse, uh, put in a pillow bag, and now is in one of those drawers right here. And while the battle was yeah. going on outside, uh, Cheezle just destroying all, just absolutely wrecking all the guards and everything out there. Uh, Qua has remained guard against the dresser as the little rat scurries in a pillowcase. Um, and I, that concentration can be maintained for one hour, um, which is that, and that is where we left off. The battle has concluded. You have wiped out all the guards within the area, and we shall resume. Looking for a theme, looking for a theme. <sighs> where the heck is it? There it is. We shall resume from there. All right. Uh, you guys have just murdered uh, the goblin vodka. Um, uh, I was all Benji. Uh, Benji murdered the goblin That's vodka. Blood's on his hands. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, no, no. There's definitely blood on Pakel and Clarence's hands. It's just uh, like nah. Blood. We were never able to hit him. There's literally none yeah. of his blood on our hands because we couldn't make contact with him. Yep, that's true. It's that's all true. you. So sad for you guys. It's very sad. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, and how much money did you promise me, by the way, for I the kill? I said I'd give you 500, but you didn't know how to count, so I gave you the fucking, like, small <laughs> pouch instead of my it actual felt right. money. It felt right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, what are you all doing? Eating oh, Indian food. We should be immediately running towards that room, right? Because we heard the, the screaming. Yeah. Yeah, immediately start bolting over. Mm -hmm. well, Let's okay. get a check before they do. Uh, is there any like barring mechanism, like locking mechanism at the store? Yeah, absolutely. You could uh, totally bar the door for any evasion. Absolutely going to bar this door. Okay. Good idea. Because there's a ton of guys outside. Yeah. All right. So we you made a lot of noise too. Do you, Actually, uh, yes. Brett, sorry, mm -hmm. I forgot to ask this. When I killed vodka, was that? Did I see anything outside? Any other goblins or anything? 
No, no goblins are rushing in. You can only assume okay. Happy is doing his best to distract them from the other okay. fort. Cool, cheers. All right. We'll lock uh, it anyways. Just door still, sure. yep, you still bar the door. And uh, yeah, continue on um, model. Yeah, just, I mean, I'm, I assume everyone's gonna probably wanna run up to this place. You begin, yeah, walking over uh, all the all the corpses, the warg there yeah. wagging his tail happily. Looking at everyone. Is the face? And you see yeah. a double door. Do you uh, open the double door? Question again. Am yes. I invisible and covered in mud still? Or is that now Wayne? Because it was uh, one minute, right? Prob- I would say probably enough time has passed now where your well, greater invisibility hour? is. It's a minute. Is it it's a minute. Wayne or greater invisibility. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, been. It's, it, it's, it's, it's gone. It's yeah. gone. So now I'm just a regular goblin covered in mud. Good. Yes. Good to know you're, I'm all. Yourself. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> that is correct. Yeah. I'm going to open the door. All right. You kick open the door. Just kidding. You open it gently. Uh, Qua, you... Uh, okay. Uh, door kicks open. Qua, you hear a loud noise to the south. Qua takes, oh. like, a, Qua takes like a kung fu ready pose. <laughs> Does it break your concentration to be shocked like that? <laughs> yeah. You almost startled me. Sorry, mate. How's it going? Mm, pretty good. And you? Pretty good. Yeah. Where's the princess? Uh, yeah, what the hell happened here? Um, in here. And it kind of gestures at the drawer that I'm putting my back against. You hear I, a uh... gentle scratching from within the drawer. Wow, she must be a very small, dainty princess. I, I thought, I thought she was bigger than uh, Cheese. Mm, she Most was. was. What do you now mean by she, she was? Is what, did you, what did you do to that? that? That's really ominous, Qua. I Qua, what turned the hell did you do? her into a mouse. Oh. Like a, she like was a, gonna... Yeah. The dog. Did like a, is that like a permanent thing? Or is this like a... Uh... Mm, no. How long does it last? Do we have time? Mm, yes. <laughs> All right, we have time. Cool. You want to just like hunt them somewhere, like in a hole and bury them or something? I don't know. I don't want them to come back out. No, wait, wait, wait. Eat the dog. We don't want to. Wait. Yeah, but we don't want to kill the princess, right? It's Cheezle's love. You I... think we should kill her if she was trying to eat my dog? Did Cheezle seem valid. to care about them, or is this kind of like a revenge thing? Cheezle was in love, I believe. Well, yeah, then again, when like is he wise. not? Cheezle. Where the hell is Cheezle? <laughs> Uh, I'm Cheezel, trapped, Cheezel. I'm trapped in a void! I can't see! It's yeah, wait, what black. happened to Cheezel? Uh, My she... screen is pitch black, I know Z! Oh, I see. <laughs> Out of character, right. Uh, uh, do you see your token now? I see my token, but everything is black. I see nothing. That's weird. Now okay. I see everything. It? I, I oh. moved you five feet, and now you yeah, loaded it in. Yeah, sometimes it takes a second to load the line of sight. <laughs> no worries. Okay, Cheezel here now. Cheezel <laughs> runs in with a smile. Cheezel, <laughs> you were the one that knew her. What do you want to do with them? Well, could you just go be hostage? Hostage is easy. You can definitely hostage. Uh, you really oh. like put it down from your love, right? Down to potential hostage. Very quick, Cheezel. You sure you don't what want to say hi? All is fair in love and Gobi Wool. Wow. Right. Wow. Mature beyond his age. We have a similar saying among turtles. What's oh. that for? What is, what is All it? is fair in love and turtle war. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Right. It's true. Because you know what's coming here. Yeah. Very similar. I mean, look. Earth green. If, if we want, we take him out of that polymorph. If I could charm him just like that. Oh, that or, or cloned. <laughs> Jesus, I don't like idea. this. I don't like this. I, I mean, I think it's what Jesus' if, decision on this one. We don't really need her. Um, it is. What yeah. if we present the chief Big Belly with peace offering of his favorite food, Red. <laughs> oh my that god. Is, oh, that, that is, is extremely... I, I, I mean, oh, I just Jesus, murdered someone, Chisel, oh, and that's no. bad. Does, does Chief Big Belly eat rats? Oh, 
Gucci Big Belly Lava Red. <laughs> this, oh this, is, this is extremely dark. You think of a very good idea. Yeah, I'm you not wanna do it? I mean, oh my you god. You think it'd work? Uh, I'd like to try to remove the rat from the drawer without being seen. Uh, go ahead and do a stealth check, please. Yikes, that's not a good for me. Um, <laughs> yeah. What's, well, I mean, it's against passive perception, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, every, that, every, yeah, everyone you sees you turn over to the drawer, <laughs> open it up, and then to just pull out this uh, pillowcase with I'm this sorry, Qua? something moving through it. Yeah, everyone sees you. How are you doing, Qua? What's mm. up, Qua? You got a plan? Yeah, plan. <laughs> so, Qua, how long does a polymorph hold if someone's eating them? Um, oh my god. Oh my god. He'd bite oh. down and she'd blow up in his mouth, blowing up his oh head. Oh my god. She'd fucking blow up his head. I don't, don't mess with Jesus. No. <laughs> but I don't know about this plan. I mean, Qua, it's Jesus. No. This is Jesus' thing. You gotta yeah. let the boy do it himself, even if it mm. is extremely fucked up. Oh, oh, all of us for life. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hand the pillowcase to Chisel. I'm going to hold the spell, but <laughs> I pretend I do not see. <laughs> and like Chisel looks at the bag and he's like, <laughs> he's just like, revenge is mine. <laughs> so so all right, well, so where's dark. the kitchen? Shall we make the pie, the rat pie, or how are we doing? I mean, I, do we need to prep it, or is this like a uh, like, like so raw rat? Raw. Yeah, I don't really know the man, but this place I mean, is pretty we, fancy. We can't do much right. if that thing gets hit at all. It polymorph breaks. No, no, no. Maybe a sandwich then. It needs uh, to be something gentle. It. Right. I, you know, this place is pretty fancy, though. I don't imagine he eats raw rats anymore. I mean, it might be like a sort of like I don't know. You might that might be like a you know like it that way. Who knows? Oh, maybe, what maybe. if we put in pickle brine? <laughs> I don't have right. any more pickle brine, do I? Uh, it's Aren't it's it, you conjure a new one every day. It's uh it's it's pretty dried out because of your your yeah, face cause cracking. Dying, yeah, because everyone's know? dying. That is correct. Oh. Yeah. Um, how do you feel about making a little rat sandwich, Jesel? It's okay, rat sandwich, good. Yeah. Sometimes too much bread, not enough bread. You know, well, you here's the one thing I think like. it probably uh, isn't going to land super well. I don't, if Chief Big Belly's where he probably is, uh, he sees a bunch of random goblins he doesn't know just walk in with a random sandwich. Do you think he's going to actually eat it? I mean, do we need to ask him to eat the sandwich or can we just feed him the sandwich like what are we doing are we trying to kill him because i mean we're t i think his death is sort of on the menu regardless right. no, literally, i don't yeah. think he's gonna be Same with very daughter. welcoming to us <laughs> that's right yeah no so if we're trying to kill the guy i don't really think we need to i don't know do you want to assassinate him and get out or are we just trying to kill him no no we murder all gobby see every gobby you hate everyone here. Yeah? Every WC. What happened to you, Cheezo? Why do you hate these people? They so mean to Cheezo. Stole Cheezo birthright. Birthright. Right. right. Wait, what? Cheezo, what's Jesus? your birthright? Cheezo, what kind of birthright you have? Murder. <laughs> uh, um, your okay, birth, hold your on. birthright is murder. <laughs> murder with Chief Big Belly. Your birthright so is to me, murder so Chief hey, Big Belly. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's true. Your birthright was murdering Chief Big Belly. Yes. Right. Are Did they you... steal it by not dying? I don't know. Okay, I don't know either. I man. Don't, I, oh, Granny Gobby, who wrote this? I don't think she knows Jesus. what he's talking about. No, it's uh, true. Right, right, but what's true? What is true? <laughs> what is true right now? Because this sounds like you're just sort of making things up. Jesus. No. Look at all the killing. Don't it. tell it's Porky like, Pies, Jesus. Don't make a bunch of stuff up. Just say it how it is. Ready and village say Jesus. Yeah. Put right to take out the big belly. Right, yeah. And so you want to kill him because it's your birthright, right? It's yeah. Like, I don't know the usage of the word birthright. I just not yeah. even birthright. It's, it's, it's just like you're born a plan. Right. It's not really like birthright. It's it's like, oh. You're a mercenary, Jesus. <laughs> it's just a dream you have. Did someone just oh. tell you to kill him? Who told yeah. you? Old Granny 
in village before village burned down. But did Chief Big Belly kill your village? Did he burn it down? What? Muddle, well, muddle. What? Muddle. I'm, I'm trying to make sense. Way. No, I, I know. It's just like now I'm starting to think like, I don't know if I want to take the wind out of Chisel's sails so close to the end. I mean, it's probably more helpful if he wants yeah, to kill the guy right. than not. It's therapeutic at this point, for sure. Yeah, maybe maybe <laughs> just right. let him roll. I, I mean, I don't want to see a head explode with a daughter kinda, inside you know, a father's mouth either, exploding. I don't want to either, but... I want to see our head explode. Look, only other Bloody option hell. is like we just huck them off of the Atlas or something. Something... something. I, I, no. I think it's got to be that kind of... That level. would be what, never that'd be what you or I would probably want, but Cheezle wants this his way. Okay, we've got we've to do it the way Cheezle wants, right? All right, then we need to stop trying to deflate his whole plan by asking if he even really wants to do it. You I, know I, I was curious, about. right? It doesn't mean I was saying no. Does anybody have any bread? Or lettuce, tomatoes. So why not to make a rat a rat? Yeah, I got something in my backpack, <laughs> I think. <laughs> that what? Yeah. Why did that make me laugh so much? <laughs> 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 all right. A rat We're looking rat. around for a kitchen. Look, all right. Some of, the, some of us got to look for a kitchen. I know some of us got to look for the actual secret entrance, right? You said it was under like a statue, right? That's what happens. Yeah. So. Maybe walked right by it. Oh, Jesus, right. sorry, I didn't like that right. Everyone begins to leave the area. Clurnt, uh, as you begin to walk out the hallway, you notice a couple of the goblin corpses appear to be missing. Oh. Right, bro. Uh-oh. Uh, what's wrong, mate? There's a couple bodies missing. Uh, oh. Clarence, as you as you walk over, you see Qua is surrounded by three goblin uh, zombies. Oh my god! Oh yes, I'm glad this happened. No, no, what? not that one, Qua. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, and immediately no. fire bolts it. <laughs> These are my boys. <laughs> Hold my boat at the ready, just in case that, you that miss. One, that one will be your boy, not this one. This one stays dead. You do to me. Hang on, wait a minute. Actually, Qua, you Claire, don't understand. Claire holds it for a second. Qua, if you. Qua, do they retain any of their personality when you do this to them? Mm. I oh my God. give them a personality. All right, so you're saying that, well, look, it's been established that goblins kind of do a reincarnation thing. We all know this. Now, if you keep this guy in a sort of purgatory limbo for the rest of his days, that actually might be even cruel fate than death. Mm. Clark starts to walk away. I'm going to whisper to Qua. <laughs> Qua, can you make them say things? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you make this one say sorry to Clem? Because he's never going to get over this, and it's actually changing the way he acts, right? Oh, okay. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> I Please command quiet. this zombie <laughs> to walk over to Clarent, and I don't, I don't think it can like speak. But to the best of its abilities, it's what gonna. Just, what are you doing? It's gonna just like. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> Bert thinks it's attacking him and immediately casts Firebolt at it for 25. Uh, that, that hits uh, for <laughs> six points of damage. Uh, let me go and double check something real quick. Uh, the goblin zombie is still standing with a blasted hole through its chest. Fucking hell. Oh Don't stick up on me like that again. Are you really going to die again? Well, Sorry. <laughs> um, the uh, goblin, uh, when it attempts to say sorry, all you hear it go is, Arr! and then when you blast it, hold it through the chest, it goes, Arr! because you've now completely destroyed its voice box. Nice. <laughs> Good. And now I can never say sorry. Great. <laughs> let's uh, let's take a look around, all right? Yeah. Why are we looking for a kitchen? Well, look, some of us need to find a kitchen if we're going to make that wrap. Yeah, well, we need some to of decide, us... do we want the lettuce wrap or... Yeah. Want... I don't know, Chiso, does the guy lettuce. like lettuce? What? No, Chief Big Belly no like big. He's got a big belly, I doubt he, he likes big lettuce. Belly. Right. So maybe stick the lettuce unless it's like, you know, part of the wrap, but not the yeah. not the wrap part of the wrap, you know what I'm the, saying? The, the, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. It's got to be part of the ingredients, not That's part of right. the main presentation. Uh, Brett, what is the? Are these rat statues? Uh, those are rat statues. That is correct. Amazing. <laughs> Interesting. Oh That's my god, we could do something. Weird. A play here. <laughs> That's weird. I don't remember that when I came in. What's the play? Yeah. <laughs> I would definitely hear. I swear. God, are, are there any that are the, near the size of an actual rat? 
Um, oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. They are all the size. It's just a stack of, uh, of, uh, it literally looks like just stacks of rats up in the corner that are okay, just uh, statues. Can I take one or chip, like snap one off that's the size of a little rat? Uh, yeah, go ahead and do, give me a, uh, while you're just taking a knife and just like chiseling through over chiseling there. Chiseling or just snapping like a small one, right? That's only connected by its little feet. So I'll just yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me go punch ahead it with my palm. He yeah, wants me... a little rat statue. Uh, yeah. So you'd like, as you pull one back, you literally break the head off of one of the statues. Nice. <laughs> Wait, so what do I have? Uh, a you headless have this rat? You have a, you have a, no, you have a head of a rat. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. I'll, rat I'll take it. I'll he wants a rat me. action figure. Come on. <laughs> it's okay. We'll just, we'll just, I don't know, turn the princess to stone or something later. We'll figure it out. It's fine. <laughs> Clarence eyeballing the uh, statue here. Okay. Try to find where this opening might be that Happy uh, was talking about. Uh, hold on one second. Yeah. I'm shoving a goodberry in the hole in my zombie. <laughs> oh no. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> are we all healed up, by the way? Uh, I don't think anyone no. was in. Oh, uh, no, we, we haven't had a rest. We I don't think exactly we missed really damage. Time. Sorry, I didn't mean uh, that we had a rest. I meant, are we all full HP? Are we all good? I think I'm, we uh, are. Yeah, I think, I think you're think the only so. one that isn't. Wait, Unless why am I good? Yourself. Yeah, I'm full HP, bro. Uh, probably because you went over to your character sheet, which then ba goes over to D&D Beyond, which then it auto heals you if we're if you're not uh, taking hit points away from your character sheet, unfortunately. Uh, give me oh. one second. Sorry. Uh, my mind is. I, I, I can you, check. But I didn't heal you to full. I could check last episode if you want. Yeah, I appreciate that. My monitor stand is being busted. I need to get a new one because it keeps propping one of my monitors and. That's oh. annoying. Yeah, so I'm just trying to get that fixed. And then D&D Beyond's being... Okay. At the end of last episode, Pikel had 112. I had 112. Those are my two HPs. Sorry about that. Uh, Pikel, uh, Pikel has 112. You said you had 112? I had 112. Oh, okay. You guys uh, are Chisel welcome. Had a hu you guys are welcome Chisel to some had... of these good berries if you want a full heal. Uh, so Bree healed got? me up to 112. Uh, sorry. Ten. Skipping through. Oh my God. And they heal for... Seven, I believe. Well, they use an action to do it, so I guess using them now is the best time. I mean, I've already given it to my zombie. Yeah, well. <laughs> well, Goodberry heals for for one hit point, correct? Four. Oh, you got like a healing subclass. She's like one six one. Life cleric or whatever. Oh, very cool, very cool. Okay, let me go over here. I can. Uh, uh, oh, Forty hit points to divvy out. It's all good. It's all gravy. All right, so I'm gonna just say model is at 112. You have to bind through there. Uh, and you said uh, Pikel is through 112. Was I just wrote any? them all in the thingy. Yeah, oh. Chisel is 161. Thank you, some. That's all I could see. Okay. Everyone else should be. Well, also, uh, Clarent got stabbed, correct? I got. No, no, we remember they, I, they, uh, we healed at the end. Displacement. Oh, gotcha. Oh, That's up. right. You yeah. weren't stabbed. Okay. Okay. Cool. 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 Okay. Cool. All looks good to me. Cool. We got everyone set to where they need to be for now. Uh. Okay. Uh. So what? What is uh? What is everyone doing? Clarence investigating. He rolled a twenty-four, staring at okay. the statue. Okay. Uh, as you investigate the statue, you notice no mechanism whatsoever. This uh, naked goblin statue. This naked muscular goblin statue. Is simply for um, appearance sake. Nothing in this area seems to be. Right. Okay. So this is just in. a. Okay. A twenty-four is pretty high. I mean, I we we have something I could do. Does charm work on someone that's polymorphed? Uh, what that kind works. of charm are you doing? Uh, just the basic one that I use. Charm last person. Time to, uh, with complete, yeah, charm person. Like if, um, if I if I if they had to lift the polymorph, I guess I could charm them easily. Yes, yeah, so you would have to lift the polymorph to actually use charm person. Okay, well that's the last resort then, is we mm -hmm. can just ask Princess Bigger Belly. Are you uh, um well? So here's the question: Are you investigating through the whole area, or are you just investigating this area? I mean, I'd say I'm investigating the whole area. Okay, uh, so well, yeah, with, we could give it a look over. Yeah, so with your 24 investigation, let me go and move you around the map. Um, you look oh, around. Oh, there. <laughs> yeah, you yeah, look around to say, see dude. a statue oh, with uh, with open arms like it, okay. over there. Yep, yep, yep. 
Um, I assume you, that was like the kitchen over there. Yes. So your investigation shows that there apparently is something, uh, some grooves uh, over here within the floor of the open arms, um, but nothing, no mechanism that's linked to the statue itself. As you continue to look around, you see another side statue over here in the uh, in the side empty hall, um, where the arms that, of this statue apparently uh, has a weighted mechanism with a bowl that is empty. Uh, uh, we need to put something in this thing over here, model. Oh yeah, come on, yeah. boy. Hey, model, you mind climbing in that bowl for a minute? I'm just gonna look at what yeah. it's over here. Peek around the other side. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, should I roll acrobatics? Nope, no need. You're uh, you're not in any rush, and uh, you're dexterous. You go into right. the bowl, and as you do, uh, you feel the arm, the bowl, just go down just a little bit. Hmm. You may need something uh, uh, heavier what's uh, for the that bowl. Problem. Heavy enough. I'm trying to get something heavy inside this bowl thing over here. Uh, I think we start dragging bodies. Over. I know just the thing. Yeah. What about boys? Qua claps. <laughs> oh, you're literally playing Pikmin right now, Qua. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and so while uh, <laughs> while you all are trying to get out of the bowl, you'll see these goblins like kind of like shove shove off to the other side, and they just begin to like scurry around. And as they do, uh, you will see the bowl uh, begin to depress a little bit more with the arms. Uh, you're getting there, but not quite there yet. You'll need some more weight. Uh, right. Scoot over. I guess Qua's probably pretty. How is Qua gonna get it? Is how high up is that? It's depressing now. It's going down. So. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. So Qua, you struggle a little bit with the depressed, uh, with the depressed bowl as you then kind of like scurry up to the bowl and then sit back down into it. Your hefty total yeah, weight. Yeah, your hefty total weight with the corpses of three goblins pushes it down completely. As you will then wow. hear a <laughs> echo in the room next uh, next to you. Oh, hold on right there, Quad, don't move. Okay. Uh, guys. Hey, anything? Yeah, it worked. Uh, you'll hey, see, help. you'll see uh, mud-like stairs descend down underneath the earth. Is hey, this Quan, gonna stay like that? Off again for a second? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Qua, as you climb off, you see the bowl, uh, the bowl raise back up, and as it, uh, and it, as it does so, uh, you will see, um, the stairwell begin to close as the floor will. Uh, yeah, close back over the stairs. And after about, I'd say about ooh, six seconds, the stairs side. There is no fucking way goblins built this. This is way yeah, too no, intricate. This is, mm. uh, this is a whole lot. And I can Quad also tell you there's no up. fucking way Quaz getting all the way over here before that stairwell closes again. We got well, to get some polymorph. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> no. I also wouldn't mind having a way to leave. <laughs> between you and um, me. I can create yeah. 45 pounds of food and 30 gallons of water and put it on the bowl. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, 45 like pounds? pounds? 45 yeah, pounds of say. food and 30 gallons. Yeah, how long does that take you to do? 30 gallons like, of water is pretty decent. Uh, instantaneous. Is that Hero's Feast? It's uh, create food and water. Last oh, 24 that's a, hours. That's a Make good a one. a bunch of water and just food and just dump it all in there until it finally yeah. with the, I can do it with the goblins, like the goblin zombies. Yeah, yeah, we'll leave the zombies. Yeah, I'll but do it. is that we can like just pounds. we can see if that's enough. For, I weigh four hundred fifty pounds. Yeah, but already with three, it was quite low. Yeah, yeah. Even my goblins it. are probably about mm, forty pounds. Yeah, <laughs> maybe right. thirty to forty so. pounds a pop. Yeah. The, war, go. the war well, can get in if we need to. It was a pleasure with you. It oh, really yeah. was. Stay but you we need to go. <laughs> I'm gonna, uh, I'll try Find to do that. Find your mud. <laughs> let's, uh, let's all walk up to it and, like, hold it down with our hands so that Pikel can, like, pour in food and water. All right, how many, uh, how many gallons of water are you doing? 30 gallons. Apparently, that's 240 pounds, apparently, like, according to one person in chat. Oh, well, <laughs> so let me just go ahead and, true. let me go ahead and just use chat to roll his eyes. <laughs> um, all right, so as you splash in 30 pounds of water into the bowl itself. 30 gallons of water. Or 30 gallons, excuse me. Uh, it. Yeah, that's 250 pounds. 
It fills yeah. it up into 250 pounds. Plus the weight of the goblins. And plus the weight of the goblins. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, uh, as the bowl itself fills, it'll completely decompress over there. Perfect. All right. Wow. Good job, Pickle. So, uh, how long is that water going to stay in there? Uh, it's about uh, 24 days, hours. Uh, <laughs> days, hours. <laughs> oh, wait, hours. So I, don't realize, minutes, I don't think Pico sorry. would know that, so I just... Uh, don't you have a any long hours? time. Have a functional understanding of any spell you have? I, I guess so, yeah. I mean, right. you can role play it how you want. I don't know if she can count that high. I, 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 yeah, boys, I, maybe, maybe she just knows it's like a long it's time. It's about a while. day. Uh, right, so right, as you right. say, good job, boys, come on, and the goblins yeah, will the goblins slowly begin down. to leave off. And as they uh, as they do it, you will see the stairs once again disappear leave back them. up. Leave them! What, what the hell is going on back there? <laughs> what do you mean? They're my boys. They They're not your boys, me. you just picked them up today! They go where I go. Um, I mean, I can do 45 pounds of food as well. <laughs> Fuck. It's right. and. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But because that's like forty pounds per goblin spell slot. For yeah, 20 how much do goblins What about just vodka? What about just vodka? What about what if yeah, he's the one? Just that's just like, they're all my boys are with me. Also, Brett, I think I healed vodka with a good berry. Uh, yeah. How much did Plus you heal? He, three, you said. A full. Whatever will full heal him. Uh, oh, oh, you're gonna keep healing. To have a good berry myself would be Is there really any just garbage? These look like garbage yeah, rocks on the ground. Can we just pick up these fucking rocks and throw them in it? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you yeah. can throw whatever you want in hey, there. Mother, let me carry this slab. All right. <laughs> so you begin to bring. <laughs> you, lift <laughs> you lift up the slab. You slowly carry it over, and you just dunk yeah. it down. Uh, <laughs> into the into the bowl and as you do so is just with a heavy slam into the bowl you just hear the arm me mechanism snap down and uh, <laughs> and you just hear from the other room uh, as the hey. stairs are now permanently revealed fucking hell oh my god right. good job on the water and food though pickle oh it's a shame sure. we don't get to eat it though you can come back to the bowl and eat it. <laughs> you might as well give me control of these guys, Brett, because they're main characters now. <laughs> Greg, I want you to know that stuff. if they don't die, we will kill them. Yeah, yeah they're on a time limit. You, you can't kill them even though they're already dead. Oh, <laughs> we can kill them a second time. For one, sure. <laughs> one second. It'll probably involve fire. One second. Ha -ha. What is dead may die again. Yeah, one will second. die again. Will die again. Uh, oh, I see. So, can we take a roll to know if Chief Big Belly heard us slamming the door 18 times? Open, open, close, open, close. <laughs> like a door open. Yeah, it was yeah do, you, do, you know what the, do you know what the roll is? The roll is, hey, did you guys... Hey, he's screaming hey. downstairs. Did you hear that? Yeah. Did you hear us doing what, what, that? What was that sound? Yeah. Did you hear us doing that? Can we do that some more? Uh, okay, one second. Let me... Uh, I just, I'm going to get these, these goblin, these goblin tokens set up. These zombie goblin tokens. This isn't to be worth very it. important for the plot. This isn't worth okay, it. Okay, real talk. I, I, well, I want and, us to and, leave. And then I'm, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to use the restroom. We'll take a little bathroom break. Oh my oh, God, you scared you guys. right away with your bullshit. <laughs> can we, can we leave in exactly 24 hours? So as we leave, the food the disappears. The door closes on all three zombies and we just catch <laughs> yeah, all three of them. Yes. What's wrong We need with to you? time it. What's you don't know the you? end character. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Well, we goblin telepathy at it. It's a thing. Dude, <laughs> you guys know. gotta take advantage of goblin telepathy more. After. Model, fact, model, you gotta pay me. You gotta give me that fucking pouch back. That like, you didn't I'm kill surprised him. you guys talk at Wait, all. Wait, what? What pouch? The money. Give him the money back. He's, he's dead. Alive, he's, he's, dead. he's he's dead. He's just a corpse that's walking. That's a there's a difference. I get yeah, my I mean, money. I, I believe that the expectation would be that he wouldn't get back up and continue to exist. I think like. I was. I, hey, you want to know something Page funny? Try and take it. Try and take it. <laughs> oh yeah. You kill him. I can bring him back what's your, again. What's your What's your wisdom save? <laughs> Not great. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm just uh, doing a thing real quick. Almost done. Uh, I gotta give control to. Uh, oh, to Qua. There we go. <laughs> give control I'm to Claire. Sorry for necromancer RP. 
No, it's all yeah, I'm that's sorry. Enough. <laughs> Wait, is just, it uh, what's the spell slot this. used? Um I believe it was what like is it? fourth level animate dead. Oh my god, oh, for cool. for three guys, do they all have eight health? Is that like their cap? They're yeah. That's pathetic. No. Uh, well, they actually you know, I, <laughs> they actually have twenty two HP. I, I misread. Oh. I mean that's Dude, I, I summon rocks with more health than that. For the same spell. I'll write the trees and the rocks, yeah. And then I'm okay. on, of, of course, just so everyone, you know. <laughs> okay. There's RP spells and there's power gaming spells. Dude, I rock is an RP. All right, I could easily RP the rock. Any day of the goddamn uh, week, I could RP I'm gonna the rock. I'm going to use the restroom. I'll be, uh, okay. I'll be right back. This you, guy's a power Have fun, gamer. Brett. Uh, have fun in the restroom. Have fun. <laughs> Finally, piss have RP. Fun. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I could back. cast something useful like polymorph it. Polymorph at fourth level. Cast but, fire know. bolt at uh, vodka for another four damage. Add it to the meter right now, Qua. No. Taking pot shots at him. Also, when he dies, or if one of my minions die, I can use my spores to bring it back to life as a reaction with one hit point. It's like they are they are very resource heavy. You know, look, they've taken the thing all the good is, berries. I guess like the benefit is that they can do more dexterous stuff than like a rock. Nah, well, they also have boy. RP. Yeah, they, they have RP. Can they like pick up things and do things? I can command them to them? do stuff for Does 24 hours. take actions hours. in combat? Is this like a thing where you're going to have to spend actions to tell these guys what to do in a fight? Nah, get this. They get their Bonus own action. Okay, that's just, okay. Okay, that's just a normal spell. That's Got the same, it. That's the same as <laughs> animate again. <laughs> Wait, then they're not their own units. They don't I was get their expecting own them to be their own units because that would make yeah. them like okay again. No, no. So get you, this: yeah. on any turn, you can use your bonus action to mentally uh, command a creature within sixty feet of you. If you can control multiple, you can command all of them at the same time or any of them for different commands. So I could make them like all jump a guy and beat the shit out of him in like I mean, one. If turn. they all rolled like, I mean, I could mean... you technically have raised like one of the ogres? No, or only small boys, medium or small human. Oh, you, you know what though? You can. We don't have to be technically associated with them. We could stage like a Night of the Living Dead in yep. the Goblin Palace and we yep. could just have them run around attacking also, people. Also, how long does your thing last, Tomato? Because mine lasts 24 hours. Oh, much less than that. Yeah, Yeah. But... see, mine lasts 24 hours and it's I can re-up it. It's so squishy. Him. It's a shame that doesn't have like more HP is all. Dude, 20 to yeah. me is tanky as fuck. I'm used That's to, like... again, my passive thing for Spore Druid is I revive a zombie at one HP and it gets like an action and then it dies. I mean, if it gave you much more on the reaction res, that would be busted. Yeah, I guess. Because, like, that's another free turn to do whatever as long as no one kills it beforehand. So that's huge. Hey, Brett. Oh, yeah, and it's not a concentration. Yeah, tomato. it's pretty. Yeah, I, I was about to say, if it was concentration, we fucked yeah, up big I, time. I made sure that polymorph would, would be up right now. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Is it? Railroad us, please, DM. <laughs> Force us I down the stairs. <laughs> no, I, I think we'd all go. Yeah, down I mean, like, uh, if Zane last minute prep, you want to do? Can we have? Yeah, that and also, can we have a? Oh, sorry, I was muted. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, marching so, order. Yeah, feel free. Uh, what, what, what would you like your marching order to be? Could I stealth and go in front? of everyone like so 10, um put your put put yourself in the position that you'd like to be descending the staircase oh like i guess right at the front okay. if that's cool with everyone yes i actually think chisel should not be visible not my best initially. lucky could you just hyena again cool oh uh, i mean if we're trying to hide your identity you being anything other than a hyena yeah, 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 yeah. I, mean, I, I could technically you know, turn I you invisible, one more of those. which would be really could good. You, anyways, could you but... smush some good berries and like paint yourself red like one of these guys and then like just walk next to them? <laughs> would, he, would they recognize I mean, the size though? Chisel, Chisel is Chisel's the smallest small. goblin ever of all I goblins. I mean, so... if you get lost in the crowd, it's like Assassin's Creed. You just do the same thing they do, mimic them. Maybe, Sit on the maybe. bench, you know, stand yeah. in a circle. That's right. I mean, what's the alternative? Turn into a hyena? I could become again? a. I have one more hyena in me. Okay, but don't, might as well use I it guess now. We'll probably end up in combat, so it's probably fine. But yeah, wait, I mean, you're holding the brat. You're holding good. the fucking mouse. We might need to. No, I can I mean, hold it in my mouth. I, I mean, okay. could just I hold trust the mouse. you. No, no, I anyone, trust anyone. Anyone can hold fine. it. 
as long as we're following through with cheezles i feel like it's his burden to bear though do you know what i mean yeah it's like he's it's like frodo i don't see i don't think chief big belly's gonna want eating sandwiches from cheezles you know Sandwich. I thought yes. we were just handing him a it's bag a of wrap. wrap. It's actually we're doing a wrap. Just but we never got the wrap. We don't, we don't have wrap. any ingredients for the wrap. Why do you have any wheat? The food you made. Wait, yeah. <laughs> to make a wait, 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 wait. I didn't actually wait, make wait, wait. the food. Wait, wait, She didn't use the, the food. Yeah. Yeah. So can, can we say that she took some of the food? Yeah. yeah. But then it's probably gonna okay. decompress. And then... I took some. What's a great wrap? Uh, like a like tortilla bread tortilla. But like like a just, crunch just wrap plain. supreme kind of thing, you know? Oh yeah, damn! Make it delicious. Like nacho cheese. I could be wrong. Oh, but yeah, I'm sure a good spell just makes wrap. like a bread. Wrap. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The spell just makes bread. Well, you can wrap that bread into a thing. It's like it's gonna be. Just yeah, I'll bread. flatten the bread. <laughs> to That's filthy. Step yeah. on the You're bread until it's flat, and then spin it up. All right. Okay. Well, whatever breed decides to use a spell. Yeah, and also, what is your marching order down, descending down? Uh, is, 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 is this I'm it? I'm going to stealth off in front, but yeah. Control my Also, I, I, I luckied the uh, stealth by the way, Brett. Just heads up. I would like to become a hyena. Uh, you should have control. Okay, then nope. Clarence will carry the pillowcase for now, yeah? Unless you want to carry it in your mouth. <laughs> Make a crunch I'll rat supreme. All right. <laughs> you can do this. That's oh delicious. my god. Yeah. <laughs> You have control of your boys. Unless you grab the one that you literally couldn't get control of, right? Ah, son of a bitch. Ah, no. hold Got on. Two of them. No, no, it's all good. It's, uh, there's that. It's just, so, it's safe. Yep, okay. What, we've what's got, your marching we, order, guys, behind? Yeah, we've got model up front, and then who's, who's doing what? I was assuming the fucking expendable fucking zombies pretty early up. Oh, my boys were going to come with me. They could lead. Are the you, where are you going? The boys should lead. No, but Pretty, he's leading. You know, forward. Yeah, but model's gonna be stealth. Yeah, I'm stealthed up like 20 feet ahead, just ahead of you guys. Clever be sort boy. of in the middle. Uh, so Cheezle, do you want to hold the pillowcase in your mouth, or do you want someone else to carry it? Um, I think you, someone else, should present it. You know what I mean? Okay, Clever will carry it then. Mm. For now. Unless, uh, do, fuck, how are we gonna get? Look, we can. I don't know how we get them to stay still in a sandwich, right? I can wrap it really tight. Yeah, like yeah. A just, yeah. To wrap it so tight that it hurts them. Yeah, it needs to be like just, just <laughs> yep. slightly Maybe, before damaging. Maybe Hill has the touch. Don't worry. If you, you if have one yeah. HP, yeah. we could <laughs> cut, uh, like, go around all this dexterity shit that Brett's gonna make us roll by Clarence just doing a level one sleep, knocking it out for a minute, and then you wrapping it very tight. It'll why just don't... wake up. Why not just hand Chief Big Belly the bag with the rat in it and go like here? No, like, because what if he like opens rat. it and then the rat runs out and escapes? Yeah, no, and what if he it. squeezes it? No, he might yeah. not eat it. He's bougie yeah, AF he might not for eat a goblin. It. So He's we gotta dress it chief. up. Dress Let's it up. dress that rat. Let us have cooking RP. Come on. Uh, <laughs> this is fun. You got to have your RP with the this three is... zombies. <laughs> dude, right? yeah, dude, dude, dude. RP. We we can put some mushrooms on it if you want to like put some yeah. mushrooms inside the wrap. You see? Oh yeah. my god, drug him. So even yes. if yes. Oh my god, dude. This is a plan. You and Oh this my is God. a plan. This is going crazy. I love it. So um, what? What is the? What is the plan? Sleep. What? What are you all doing? I have a trap and, and I'm ready to I'm fucking go. Rat and a wrap. <laughs> Come on, get us some of those. Uh, what? Some of those mushrooms, all right? <laughs> some of the crazy mm, ones. Yeah. Why? We we're gonna look. If he doesn't end up eating the rat part, he might eat some of the mushroom part, and that mm, fucked up some of us. Yeah. Okay. And I can while create him an image of a sandwich. Back. How does that help anything? Jesus. <laughs> I can get him stuff from the back shelf. The shelf like the, being my the shell. Bad stuff. Mm hmm Strong stuff. Nice. Once you have a plan, let me know. Okay. We are actively currently right now. All right. This is Chipotle. Let's go. I'm assembling burrito. <laughs> All right. Well, if we don't have the meat, we'll kill him tomorrow. The burrito? The burrito? <laughs> <laughs> how, Brett, nice. how squirmy is this rat right now inside the uh, pillow? I mean, the, the rat's just trying, been trying to gnaw at the bag this entire time. Yeah, okay, we might be able to time. We're going to cast a level one sleep on the rat. I know it doesn't yeah. have much HP, so can we just assume it goes unconscious? All right. Uh, uh, which uh, so you're taking out? You're taking using a level one spell slot. Level, is level, that correct? Yeah, I'm going to use a level one spell slot to knock it out. I'm assuming PKL is going to be able to wrap it in such a way that once it wakes up, guys. it's going to be unable to function. Guys, all I, right. Yeah. The wait, rat wait, wait, falls guys. asleep. And on top of that. 
Summa gave me a bunch of meth, right? A bunch oh my of god. god. What does it do, though? Meth. We don't know, we but it could be buff. epic. It could be okay. a buff, though. So, well, I'm willing so... to roll those dice. Uh, you now have one minute of sleep to do what I you need to do. I open up the bag and I okay. pour the bag gently over the tortilla. Okay, I'm okay. double wrapping, so I got two tortillas down, you know, okay. Chipotle style. Okay. I'm not sponsored. Uh -huh. um, uh, and I put down cool. some cheese on top of the rye and uh -huh. some, Ooh. you know, sticky, Is it like, freshly beans shredded, to make it like sticky. Like yeah, freshly shredded way? cheese. It looks beautiful. Clint pulls out a little bit of twine and wraps it around the rat's, like, snout so it can't fucking oh, open its there mouth. You there you go. There you go. Nice, nice. Prestigination to add flavor. Now, do you have oh, any? Uh, I don't think that does. <laughs> isn't that a temporary effect? <laughs> that? You, you, chill. Chill. you can, you can add instant. smell. You can you add like chill. some good smell. No, no, it oh. says you yep. chill, warm up, or oh. flavor up. Yeah, he is correct. Oh. Oh. He is, oh. he is, he he is correct. Okay, okay. Are we adding I mean, is mushrooms? Is it, is it What's done? happening? Uh, oh, mushrooms? Uh, Clint grabs some of the mushrooms from Qua oh. and mm. puts them on it. And I will. Are best ones? We need the good ones, Qua. These are the best. I'm going to the best. Wrap it real nice and tight, um, and then also wrap it with pages from my Bible. <laughs> oh, <laughs> As, like, oh, yeah, the foil yeah, yeah. on the outside. Like the, before <laughs> you close it, before you seal the wrap. I'm gonna, like, yes. sprinkle just a dusting of goblin meth over the top of it. <laughs> oh, my God. Ooh, it's complete. All right. It's the most beautiful meal we ever made. We got a plate for this thing? Yeah. Oh, oh she's gonna wrap it up. I gesture, I gesture <laughs> through the flat top mushroom on my head. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. How steady can you walk, Qua? Mm, I'm always balanced. So I'll make sure this rat ain't gonna squirm off and roll off. I mean, we're, we're on a time limit right now. We need to uh, go. Yeah, so as you're... Oh, it's gonna wake up either way. The thing yeah, is, we're, the intent is that we wrap it so tight that it can't yeah. do anything. We can put it, it back in the bag. It can't move. Like, yeah, as a burrito. 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 <laughs> Beautiful. Right. It puts the, holds the bag back open. <laughs> we, we, we should just go to him and say, we got your order. The, uh, <laughs> and try and, like, deliver it, like, fucking Postmates. The, the, the rat, rat, uh, the rat... We are here. At this point, the rat wakes up and is now struggling within the tight, uh, the tight creation of a rat burrito. Hold <laughs> it tight, boys. Let's go. Oh, All right, you the order bag, a rat. It, it looks like a, you know, Clint sort of does look like he's a delivery person, sort of, with the hat. All right, so, let's yeah. go ahead and see yeah. the rat burrito appeal. Uh, ooh, uh, it's still, mm, uh, not your first. Uh, apparently, this is your first rodeo. A 29 ranking on that burrito. It's not looking too hot. You're gonna have to try your best. What we to gave sell it. it. We he won't know that until he bites into it. Press digitate to make it look good. Yeah, yeah. 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 Just, like, yeah. We don't have to roll into this. Oh. Press to digitate to make it look better. Oh, <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Hold on one second. Let me go ahead and Let's just uh, cheat these judges. We don't care. Hey, there you go. Yeah. Look at that. What? what? <laughs> the visual, oh. look, the oh. contents oh, right. of it barely matters. It's, it's, oh it's just whether God. or not he's willing to eat a sandwich from us. It's not a date. Oh, is not. I add one good berry as like a fucking. A little berry with a garnish. A garnish good berry. That boosted at least fucking. Oh, all amazing. right, so all right, what? Well, look, what's the plan? All, all right, let's go. Let's get out there. What all right, so uh, so what is so the? I'm just uh, scouting ahead. <laughs> okay, so you're 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 scouting ahead. That is, is that correct? Yeah. So the second I see things, I'm gonna look around corners and stop and be really stealthy. I I luckied it to a 27. Um, okay. And then I'm gonna it, like if I see something around the corner or where they are or where people are, I'm gonna come back and tell the party just so we have some advance. All right. Telepath, then you but... will be the one that sees what's downstairs first while everyone is upstairs. Is that correct? Yep. Okie dokie. You descend down the staircase as you enter this. Blood hole. Lovely. Uh, as you look around. Uh, give me one <laughs> second. Oh my god. Why are you laughing? <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> What's so funny, model? What's so funny? Uh, I gotta tell you. <laughs> it's a secret. Is there a monster down there? So, uh, are these like, <laughs> um, docks? Uh, so, as you, as you descend down the staircase, uh, you see that the entire room is filled with mud. Yeah. Yep. And, uh, nice. here we go. Uh, and mud? that these are little wooden bridges that lay uh, upon that. 
Uh, walking they... through the mud uh, takes double your movement. The bridges okay. themselves are uh, the normal. Um, as you look around, you see a very lethargic giant goblin sitting upon his throne. It looks like something has just woken it up from a nap. Okay. I'm going to immediately backtrack straight up the stairs. <laughs> tell everybody. <laughs> Guys, all right. He is right down there. Okay. Nothing else. No, no gobbies. Does just... he? Does he? Yeah, does he look like he's going to eat? Oh, he's got a big belly. And he, is, he looks he hungry. hungry. <laughs> Why does yeah. he stay behind doors so hard to get to? I don't understand. What if he wants food? I don't well, know. That's what we're for. I don't know. <laughs> he sealed himself down there. Maybe he wants to get out. I don't know. Anyway. Look. We need Does to go it down. Look like we can sneak closer to him, or is this going? Not right really. Right no. We're gonna walk right in there, and he's gonna. No, no, no. He, he he is on the other side of an open expanse of mud. Oh, and it's just right. that, right? So, uh, was it all just mud? Are we gonna have to wade through mud? Wading. There's bridges, but they don't look very effective. That looks like gobby technology down there. Not this, right? <laughs> So, um, well, uh, look, we might need to be ain't gonna last forever, and honestly, I yeah. just want to see if this happens or not. We might need to be in like character from the get go, is what I'm saying. You want if you me to deliver? I him, mean, like... I can, I can do a character, but uh, I don't know about. Oh, I mean... <laughs> we're getting into character. Yeah, you are actor Qua. Qua. Oh my God. Not Qua. Anyone else? No, no, no Qua's fine. Are, oh. Uh, we are chefs who. <laughs> professional to, chefs. Professional yeah. chefs. Yeah. All right. Somebody so order a rat. rat. All right, Qua. A rat. Qua. They will be the waiters, right? You, you're dead guys, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what else? Maybe we use there? the one that doesn't have a hole in his chest. We can cover it up. Wait, he's he's going to recognize the waiters as his men, right? Not the good. Exactly, they're bringing him food. Yeah, they, they'd be bringing him food. Yeah, yeah but they Don't can't talk. The difference? Maybe I could be behind one. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> maybe <laughs> I could be like My right behind one invisible Qua, or something. And I am an exotic <laughs> oh, chef from all right, far that's away it. land. Clark's going to just cast disguise self on himself right. to look like one of the red goblins. <laughs> no. uh, that kind of okay. works, that's right? Way to yeah. do it, I guess. That works. Uh, your... I forgot that we had that ability. <laughs> your goblin is <laughs> first slot spell. <laughs> your goblin uh, skin becomes red. Whoa, production, dude. Whoa. <laughs> Shut up, Benji. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of your sarcasm. <laughs> All right. I will go down there with the rep. I don't know what. I don't know how the rescue are gonna get down there without him noticing all of us, though. No, we have to. Say, starting to sidle We have to be the there. Stairs. It's too far, Claire. Yeah, right? it, if you get caught up, you will die. There, but maybe you all wait at the door or something. It's like and, it's uh, like hundred feet away, mate. We won't get to you in time. Why not say it? it takes a it takes a lot to feed the king, you know? Yeah, you guys just wait, want wait, to wait, see wait. if he enjoys your meal or not, but I'll be the one that delivers. Why don't we all just stand behind Qua? He won't fucking see yes. us. You're right. Oh. In a line. I right, everyone get a line behind Qua. It's time to move. Okay. okay. Form rank. Eh. All right. <laughs> Are you like a family of ducklings? <laughs> <laughs> now you're really playing Pikmin now, Qua. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna um, eat you, motherfuckers. So che far. Cheezel, okay. are you are you turning it into a hyena or are you remaining? I'm Cheezel? a hyena right now. All right, then let me get you in hy hyena form. Quack. The that there, perfect. <laughs> Very nice. Perfect. Uh, is everyone descending or is Clark just descending? Everyone's We're descending, descending right behind him, yeah. Yeah. Like a big line. We're a big procession. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Uh, one moment then as I move you all down ramp. You know, I did just realize this fight's going to suck really bad if we have to fight uh, both of them together. <laughs> we got to hope that this uh, stuff... Both of... Uh -huh. Oh, right. Right, there's a full HP mini boss under there. <laughs> yeah, but we can dispatch them very easily, apparently. They don't have many or resistance. He, he you can always banish daughter, one of them, and we don't. No, I don't yeah, here's, here's, what, here's what I predict <laughs> is actually going to happen. Assuming we get the sandwich to him, which I doubt, he's going to bite it, 
she's gonna turn back and it's just gonna like hurt him for like six points of damage and they're gonna no, 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 no. us dude you I need the second he bites it you just shove it down his throat like the whole way <laughs> what the fuck yeah just, i'm gonna shove it all the, the way down, down his I throat i think we should probably have just catapulted it into his mouth like <laughs> That's, right. that's, that's accuracy that I don't trust Skagzak all to have. All right. Okay, is not everyone, with his concussion. Is everyone ready going, to go? We're, we're ready. Let's we're do ready. it. All we're right. Ready. You descend down into the deep mud pit. It is a pit filled with red blood-like mud. Uh, wooden uh, bridges are around the entire area, which allows you to walk normal speed. But walking through the mud, as I mentioned before, um, counts as hindering terrain, causing double movement. Learn as you walk in, dressed up as one of the red goblins, uh, you begin to immediately get stuck within the mud, slowly walking forward as everyone descends down the mud-like staircase. And to the north, you see him. A very large goblin sitting upon an old oh! run-down throne. Oh my God. <laughs> He's heaving oh, yeah. and breathing heavily and looks a bit lethargic, as if just awoken anything. from a nap. Brett, what is that? Is that his tongue sticking out of his mouth? That is a snaggle tooth. Here I you go. I thought it was a worm. Thank thought it was a worm. You. Oh, welcome. That does kind of look like a worm. That's yeah. a snaggle tusk. That's well, huge. Uh, yeah. A broken tooth. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I guess I'm going to go over there. Yeah, we're right behind you, mate. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Boys uh, with him. <laughs> I just realized that his portrait is like heavily breathed. Uh. I was holding on my character. Yeah, so was I. I got scared. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and the the uh, chief Big Belly, heavily breathing as he's sitting on upon the throne, stares forward. His belly massive. Mm. Does he see me? Oh yeah, he's looking at you, walking over right now. Who my are you? Chief. What do you want? <laughs> it's dinner time, sir. Dinner. It's dinner time. <laughs> As he's looking forward over to you, hungry, expecting. <laughs> What's for dinner today? A delicious delicacy imported from the other side of the mm. highlands. Express. Mm. He holds his hand out, uh, waddling a little bit. Mm. <laughs> That's close up the enough. <laughs> so just have his giant hand out towards me. Oh, his his fat stubby hand is just Quack. holding it out over to you. Opens the bag and I gently takes out the wrap and places it on his hands. Fresh. He looks meat. uh he looks over at you as he holds his hand out. I don't know who you are. How do I know this isn't a? And then he looks over at the. <laughs> Delicious rat pita that you rating. presented. <laughs> it's good. S rank pita. What? <laughs> what is this delicacy? As he rolls off the throne, his floppy body slapping into the mud. He slowly <laughs> waddles over. Describe it to me. Artisanal rats aged over t decades. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the finest shelf fungus mm. from the caves beneath Ishtar. Mm. And he just waddles over through the thick mud as he stares at the pita. Please give me a persuasion check. <laughs> oh my god. Nice. Keep in mind, 25 is the lowest I can physically yeah. <laughs> But it's still a 25. Yeah. His mouth salivating. And who are you? You're not one of my chefs. Oh, I'm, uh, I'm whiskey. I'm vodka's brother. Clerk points at vodka <laughs> behind <laughs> mm -hmm. Vodka's head is dangling off I his shoulders. I make vodka do a little, like, a little, like, you know, hand to forehead wave. Yeah, we didn't fix up vodka. Nope. No, he's not looking so good. <laughs> Chief Big Belly staring at vodka for a very heavy moment before he looks over at whiskey. A friend of vodka with a delicious, delectable 
treat. <laughs> he's it's like coughing up. Like his sweat his is phlegm terrible. is everywhere. Yeah. Oh my, he just, he can barely <laughs> breathe his hefty form as he holds Whoa. out his thick hand. <laughs> oh. Awaiting the pita. Clark hmm. gently places it on his hand. Quad covers his own. And his sort eyes. of bows and takes a step back, bumping vodka kind of into the mud as he just sort of steps steps back one with a with a nice bow. Alright. Chief yeah, cool. Big Belly will climb back onto the throne, squeezing onto the pita. You hear the screeching of the mouse within. As it's just screaming oh in terror. God, so Rod's got his hands over his eyes, but he's peeking through. Chief <laughs> Big so, Belly so ignoring dark. it. Um, so, so it's all smiles. So oh we are. Uh, I, I'm going to consider this high stress. Uh, I would yeah. require. <laughs> we are literally uh, teetering right now. Bad. I would like roll everyone over. to oh roll God. their initiative at this time. Please make sure your token is selected. Oh, that's a nat one, baby. I can I, I, you can't lucky in that one, can you? Mm, do you want to luck? So let me uh, first of you all can. let you know uh, a new rule I'm beta testing for initiative. Uh, you okay. can spend your reaction on your round to re-roll your initiative if you wish. Mm. Mm. That sounds awesome. Yep. Uh, I think I, you can. I, I will. I will be happy to beta test that. <laughs> so absolutely. <laughs> Um, all right, we have entered high uh, stress. Everyone has rolled their initiative at this time as the hefty Chief Big Belly. Now this is some irony. His heavy weight. He was going to eat me. <laughs> heavy weight <laughs> upon the throne. The old Chester's wood there. buckling underneath his hefting form. As you just see his maw open saliva and spittle draining out and sort of like trailing down his lip as he holds up the pita. His maw expanding abnormally slow so as he swallows the pita oh. in one uh, gulp. Yes. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god. He's got his eyes closed <laughs> and he That's kind perfect. of peeks and he sees that he ate it. He goes, oh no. <laughs> and he's going to cancel no. the concentration. <laughs> oh, she, oh, yeah. As Chief oh, Big Belly God. lips, uh, licks the top of his lip, he says, mm, tastes. <laughs> as you see. Like daughter. <laughs> As you see his stomach give a visible gurgle and expand. Oh. This is. <laughs> it's four. It's inflation. There's so it's many hard. elements. There's a lot of fetishes being put on this guy. Is like, <laughs> guy's ugly. And, and, and never so out. in a brief. I mean, in a brief. In, in the quickest of moments, you will see the horror of oh Big God. Belly's face <laughs> before his stomach. Imme and chest immediately ruptures open. Oh, it's like a chest burster. Oh my God. Oh my God. Re revealing all the marks. Revealing no. the princess now standing oh upon God. her. Oh as as his, as his body will immediately fall over dead, oh. sinking into the mud. Oh Gore and viscera <laughs> is covered of uh, Princess Bigger Belly as she stares at Chief Big Belly and she just. Uh, happy birthday! It's happy birthday! You ate happy my. Birthday. You tried to eat my you dog! Did you did it! It's your birthday! <laughs> she is screaming as you just see her chief big belly's body just sink into the mud and she just looks horrified at this point it's uh, the most fucked up thing we've ever done model easily. <laughs> model what are you oh my favorite my part about the fucked up thing that you guys are doing night. is you guys <laughs> planned it and then immediately looked at it and were like 
Yo, this is kind of dark, dude. I like sure? it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we, we've really, been really dark. really dark since the Cosmo arc ended. I mean, like, yeah. what happened with the it, Saren? It we us. just keep escalating. At this uh, point. model, what are you doing? It is your turn. Uh, I'm a, <laughs> I'm a I... shoot her with my bow. Okie dokie. Uh, that hits. Uh, go ahead and roll your damage. Is that surprise? Oh, absolutely. She's Are you kidding me? Auto, auto crit, then. That is an auto crit. Uh, go ahead yeah. and roll. Uh, Dude, the lack of battle music. And I was also stealth so behind Qua. Sad. It's just silence as we murder. Uh, roll 1d6. One moment. I'm going to roll a 6d6. I'm, just, I'm rolling. Because I, I, I was stealth, I also get sneak tech, right? Uh, that is correct. I'm rolling your uh, critical damage now. So, along with the 14, 19, 33, plus 31, you deal 64 points of damage to her immediately Ooh, as the arrow it's a, it's a present. stabs through her head. She it, she looks over uh, at you. Um, st I'm going to go ahead and roll a wisdom save at disadvantage. One moment, please. Oh, yeah, that's right. I can just click wisdom save. Uh frozen in fear as she is now being pelted with arrows. You just hear her loudly sobbing and weeping within this mud pit as she's shrieking <laughs> in terror. Model, it is still your round. Um, telepathy would probably say, it's probably better if we fucking kill her because this yeah, is no, fucked no, up. I, I honestly was hoping she wouldn't still be alive after the- uh, Yeah, we didn't anticipate thing. her living through I, her I, father. I, Literally, uh, the guy to bite the sandwich. They didn't think he'd eat the whole thing. Uh, yeah, she, yeah, yeah. Uh, she, she visibly does look uh, damaged uh, currently from oh, erupting yeah. from her uh, father, but also for the uh, the arrow to the head that you you. You have, mean uh, dealt. both mentally and physically, right? <laughs> oh, all, all of the above. All of the <laughs> yeah. above. Uh, model, yeah, right. you still have a move action and bonus action. Uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. That should be half my movement at forty. Okay. I'll run over there and can I bonus action hide in the mud? Just like yes, drop yes, prone? You can. Again. <laughs> Roll a stealth. Okie dokie. All right, 31 stealth. You hide within the mud. I forced myself prone. All right, that's my turn. <laughs> wow. Hey, so I didn't hear any of that uh, brain speak you guys are doing. So I'm gonna cast polymorph again. Okay. Oh my God, <laughs> you cannot. You can't. He doesn't know. <laughs> rolling the wisdom saving throw and failing what do you polymorph her into mouse okay oh, once, oh uh, once again she shrinks down again. into mouse size falling into the mud uh her little feet stuck unable to move because of the hindering terrain all right is who going to eat her next uh yeah no, we're what? gonna use it again like, what um, are you doing uh, honestly, I sort of just want to—I sort of want them to die at this point. I feel like—I feel like that's honestly the the best thing we can possibly do is move on with our lives and pretend none of this ever happened. Right. Clark says, cool. covered in blood okay. and guts. Yeah. Oh yeah. You, <laughs> like, you got he's the completely back. caked in like a layer of like just viscera. Cool. Like, how does that? How does that spell work? Can she think right now, or is she just a mouse? Mm, she's just a mouse. Right. What okay. We're sparing her the trauma. I have okay. an idea. <laughs> All right. All right, go on. Qua Easter. I know how to get rid of something. I've okay, done it on. before, but I guess we're already pretty far gone. <laughs> yeah, pretty you might say that. They yeah. started it. All right, they started it. We don't know what he did. Remember we didn't that. Work he did. out the backstory. Remember, right. remember no, the mod I, is I, double movement. I also, yeah, I yeah, also remember I that up. in character we did the paladin. I think did say. He was sent by Chief Big Belly. So technically, oh, we, we right. also were almost assassinated. Mm. He tried to assassinate. Oh, yeah. So they did start it. All right. Could it's a little late coming with the back. Paladin? Could one of you start a channel to Atlas? It's going to uh, take an hour. Can it's going to take an hour. It won't be enough time. Mm, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can uh, pull him off again. Or? Look, how about I just put him back inside the fucking the sack, and then we catapult the sack really high up, and then Miles just shoots it or something. And then oh, come out of polymorph and fall to the dead or something. Uh, I'm into better it. idea. All right, Qua, you have uh, uh, no, done your action turn. and move. I moved and I uh, yeah, so I got. All right, giant hyena. Um, one, 
to oh, oh it's happening. Just remember. <laughs> <laughs> I, yep. Oh my god. Oh no. Sheezle gives you the are most melee rage. diabolical. I oh and now Sheezle gives the most diabolical hyena laugh. <laughs> And bites the head off that stupid uh, mouse. Uh, all, right. all right, roll roll your attack roll, please. I support this fully. Uh, this is all right. a lot less complicated. So this, 20, this, this uh, with so 10 points of piercing damage, she will take nine points as she reverts back to her normal form as you try to bite the head off. Uh, you will see, uh, she's not that large, uh, your head kind of snap back as you attempt to bite. She reverts back into form, uh, covered once again in, in, in blood and guts, uh, visibly traumatized, shaken, and frozen in fear. Uh, continue your actions, giant hyena. She's as furious that she didn't die. I go into rage. Okay. <laughs> you currently are raging. Uh, you've moved. Use your action. I think rage is a bonus action. Yes, sir. Rage is a bonus. Yeah. All right, you're done. I'm raging Cl and pissed. Clarent, uh, you just keep seeing Princess Big Belly becoming even more traumatized. Uh, we can above board check how much health she has, right? With yes, you can. I'm just gonna bonus action check how much health this poor being has. This poor, oh, poor being. All right, let's go ahead and see how much health she has left. Uh, boop, 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 bring. Well, health for me. it's less than I expected. Less than I expected, but still enough that there's no Jesus. way to do it clean. No, it's just, it's got to be messy and dirty. Hey, I'd like to use my reaction to uh, do that uh, initiative thing that we were talking All about. right, as a reaction, re-roll your initiative. It's 15. All right, that's good. That's good. Uh, just a friendly, uh, just as a reminder, uh, or just to let you guys know, when you re-roll your initiative, if you get a lower amount, you have to take the lower amount, and you can't take multiple round uh, actions okay. per round. So. That, yeah. that sounds fine by me. That okay. Makes sense. Uh, and I guess I'm just, I'm not going to fucking spend anything on this poor bastard. They don't. I'm just going to cast uh, Firebolt at them. I'm sorry that they end <laughs> like this. It's going to Firebolt. That hits for, uh, for 21, 21 points of fire damage, scorching over her. This is fucked. And then he's just going to sort of sidle farther away just in case something happens. I don't know. This seems off. There's something wrong here. Dang. Uh, Pikel. Um, okay. Let's see what I can do here. So we're just trying to kill her. Is that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, we yeah. It, it, we cannot let them live. This is okay. yeah. awful. Um, also, I have a plan for off. They were too. never supposed to be alive at this part in the game. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, we, we didn't think planned. hard enough. Yeah, well, we didn't, I mean, we we didn't, didn't apply he, I was like, neurons. okay, they'll transform and then they'll both Dude, fight okay. us, and that'll my be like, interesting. For, my yeah. idea for this entire no. thing was she would pop him so bad that she would be standing where he was. Yeah, no, <laughs> I, I was I was halfway between. I thought he'd bite half of it and like his face would blow up or something. Yeah, shit, I was. No. I mean, I was expecting anything aside from the guy just fucking dying. He's gone. Uh, not twenty. Got him. By, by the by the way, Skagzag, you had, did not roll initiative. It looks like. Oh, I think he's peeing. He's, he's AFK. Oh, back. Yeah. Yeah. Skagzag uh, does a cantrip at them. Okay. Yeah. Skagzag <laughs> is concussed. Uh, yeah. Skagzag is well. Yeah. Skagzag is currently concussed. Uh, that is a critical hit with a guiding. Down the stairs yet. Yes. Uh, that is a critical hit with the guiding bolt. Nice. That's going to be good damage. Holy With crap. With a total Woo! of 23 plus 24, that is 47 points of damage. And model gets advantage. Well, oh, yeah. Shit, I'm the next. Yeah, model, go. try to do it clean. <laughs> try I'm to do literally it clean. prone right now in the mud. It's All not going to be clean. All right. It is the top of the round. And before model goes, mm. you see a <sighs> bubble within the swamp, within the mud. Over here, <gasps> and over here. Is it the worm? Because that's that'd oh, be the no. best final. No, boss. we cannot do another worm fight. As Is you will see, worm? erupting worm. from the mud, a reanimated Chief Big oh. Belly. Oh. And then no. over. No and then over here, <laughs> another Chief Big Belly. Oh. That ain't that ain't right. Oh, that just ain't right. I don't feel bad anymore, to be I don't feel bad at all anymore. Model, it's your turn. Is he... Brett, is this an illusion or is he vibrating? Is this like growing and shrinking? He's, he's heavily breathing. 
F uh, it's oh, a heavy it's breathing. Nice. Yeah. I honestly yeah. thought I was losing it. <laughs> yeah, that's all good. I dead into the I token thought... too much. <laughs> oh my god, I thought that was me that's too. Creepy. I thought yeah. I was gripping <laughs> all the balls right now. I was yep, like, yep. why is it breathing? Yep, yep. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm messing with animated tokens for big that's fights. That's really cool. Um, I'm going to put the uh, bow in my feet and then use both arms to pull back oh, the drawstring from prone. Okay. And try and uh, shoot her in Trick the shot. bloody head. Okay. Yeah. Uh, this is... Why are uh, you showing off? Uh, you are successfully hidden. Uh, 20. That hits. Oh, For a total of enough enough damage where you shoot her in the head and she falls down dead. Um, and she begins to sink within the mud. To get up? That's uh, right, from prone. Don't let him sink into the mud! Uh, I don't think we have a choice, man. I think we're gonna get the fuck out of here. Wait, I thought you needed the mud. We need the mud, model. We ain't leaving. Uh, but if they keep respawning over and over again, we're gonna get fucking killed. So we might need to just take the mud. <laughs> Qua kind of looks down the whole room. All of it. Some of it. Um, I'm going to... That was half my movement to get up from prone, right, Brett? That is correct. Okay, cool. Um, so that means I've got 10 technically in half movement. Okay. Um, all right. I'm going to move back a bit. Okay. That's two spots. And that was my action. Uh, I don't really have anything. Bonus action. Can I scan anything? Is there anything? Yes, to, you to can. Counter? There is plenty to scan for. Chief Big Perfect. Belly has the following. Uh, bah, bah, bah. I will type this all out. Let's see here. My, mm. All right, Chief Big Belly has the following. Uh, how's everyone? Uh, how's everyone enjoying the uh, session so far? Well, it's pretty I, dark. I feel liberated. Yeah, it was dark, but, like, but now then it's they fine. were fine, so it was like just funny again. This no, is like hell, oh, fuck. You know when you have functional immortality and you can just die over and over again? Yeah. Like there's no consequences for anything anymore, and then you just become yeah, completely we desensitized. Got, we should have been even darker. Honestly, is what this talk. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. And we should have gotten more fucked darker. up with it. All right. Well, I was right. We should turn it back into a mouse. Uh, yeah. Condition I, superiority, well too, vulnerability, like unstable, tauntable. Move action, uh, action oh, wow. turn, and spell casting. And this turn. is just on the one, or are they separate entities? Question mark. Because uh, I only is, scanned one of them, right? This is for both of them. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, well, I'll look up uh, con uh, vulner unstable. I'll look up unstable. Unstable. Excellent. Here we go. I'll unstable the is chat. the following. Chief Big Belly can gain unstable stacks. Every unstable stack Chief Big Belly gains uh, to hit hit uh, gains increases his two hit by one, DCs by one, and damage by one. Unstable stacks can be used as vulnerability stacks. When spent this way, Chief Big Belly gains stable stacks. Uh, every time Chief Big Belly's HP is lowered to zero, Chief Big Belly returns with two unstable stacks. If Chief Big Belly has a combination of six unstable slash stable uh, stacks and is dropped to zero HP, Chief Big Belly dies. Okay. Thank you. He, so currently turn. he has two unstable stacks. As an added thing, because uh, I didn't uh, type it in apparently, uh, for every uh, stable stack that Chief uh, Big Belly has, instead of gaining plus uh, one to hit DCs and damage, it now increases to plus two. Oh. But yes, you can yeah. use his unstable stacks to, to uh, replace them with vulnerability stacks. But then his uh, unstable stacks become stable stacks. So in other words, you're cool. exchanging vulnerability and extra damage uh, for him becoming more powerful. Gotcha. All right. Uh, Thank you. Also, since the battle has begun, I will now reveal a new mechanic that is part of that we're, we're um, currently beta testing for IO. As I reveal the following, uh, Benji knows about this. Yep. What the uh, fuck? These. That, that goes the alpha tester. Yep. These are hidden traits. You cannot scan these traits uh, at all. Um, they just kind of uh, hint what they may be. Uh, these are the pictures oh, of a pickle, trumpet. Huh? Yep. A pickle. Yep. Uh, what appears to be foggy cloud and two daggers crossed. So this guy's stealing our shit, huh? That's what it fucking looks like to me. I, I don't like that. So, yeah, uh, that's, what I, that's what it means. If you meet a condition of the trait, um, I reveal what the hidden trait is. This could be a good thing. This could be a bad thing. Yeah, they're like trap cards. But they're that like could they're also they're be good. They're effectively like uh, yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh trap cards. The moment it if has you fog. Yep. We have fog. 
Nope. Yeah, if, if Skagazag uses Fog, it might do something. If I use my knives, it might do something. If Pickel uses Brian or Pickles, it might do something. If you play music, it might do something. I don't know the music stuff anymore. Hey, you got rid of it, so that's impossible. Yeah. You're out of the band. But uh, <laughs> yeah, you can theorize uh, what activates the traits, but uh, those are the yeah. only hints that you've got. All right. Yeah. Uh, Matt, turn order. Yeah, you can turn order now. Select your token. All and right. You got it, man. I got this. Initiate. I love the card art, by the way. Brett looks awesome. Thank yeah. you. Right. I literally uh, Google searched card. That's amazing. <laughs> so you're, I would like that looks great. Great art. Yeah, I would like to. Uh, I would let me. Uh, let me check real quick. Sixteen. Nice. All right, sixteen. Gag zag and no longer concussed. Wahoo! Wahoo! Is the concussion finally gone now that he's waded through this mud? Maybe this mud finally fixes concussion once and for all. Because if it uh, isn't fixed yet, yeah, it's, it's dementia, but it's not a concussion. I don't think it is. If I roll anything but a one, the concussion's gone. All right, oh. it's gone. It's over. Yay! It's, over. it's cured. The concussion <laughs> arc. Oh, did we like free. sense anything change when we went through the mud? Like we had to walk through it to get to like where we are. No, you, you no, you do not. Not yet. Uh, okay. This card art was done mm. by Game Liberty. Game Liberty. Game That's Liberty. Good. All right. Uh, models, that ends your turn. That ends my turn. Qua, uh, you have the option to go, or you can let Chief Big Belly go. What would you like to do? Uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna go. Okay. So I'm assuming the two is not an HP bar. That's just, that is that's correct. The, the unstable stacks, right? Those are the unstable stacks. Mm. That is correct. Okay, so half movement. God, I'm really kind of fucked with the mud. 5, 10, 15, 20. Or wait, 10, 20. Oh yeah, let me also, now that we're effectively in combat, I shall lap on that grid. Um, Flat that grid. Man, I really just be out of reach of him, huh? Uh, I'm going to... God, they're all so deep in the mud. Bonus action, command all the goblins to move. Okay. Um, I'm assuming the goblins have 30 movement. Uh, they follow the same stat block as a zombie. So, uh, their movement is 20. 20. They can, all, they okay. can move two squares in the mud. So 5, 10, 15. And that's it. I'm assuming I can't. Uh, it, so can then... Qua bonus scan, boy? Just curious if that was a nice thing. Or uh, well, it's one or the other. No, I'm moving the goblins okay. instead of scanning. Oh, no, that's fine. Sorry, I just, I just meant, do you have the ability to? Is that available to you? Yep, everyone, every scan? player does. Yes. <laughs> okay, cool. Just checking. Yeah, I scan. I scanned back in the day there, bud. <laughs> um, and then let us ask a. How many people are in range of me? Um. By the way, just so you the... just so you don't feel like you 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 wasted anything, uh, by doing that little maneuver plan that you did, you literally skipped over a phase of this entire combat. So well done. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's do a, just for shits and giggles, a oh, what, by, second By feeding level. him the sandwich? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He <laughs> literally, like, you literally... I, what I thought was like, oh, we killed him without knowing the mechanics, so we yeah, made it harder by making we, two of them. No, no, no. I mean, you literally, like, phase one is him, and this next phase is two of them. So, like, you've literally skipped a, f a phase of combat I'm just by down. doing that. Second level guiding bolt, the one near me. Okay, that hits. For 14 points of damage. She is marked. Uh, you weren't able to use advantage. Uh, you, you, the next attack against turn. him is that advantage. Oop. Okay, does that end your round? Yep. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do a... So, at, he begins charging over. Hmm. I'm gonna roll a 1d4. Don't. Oh, that's Don't. a one. Here we go. Uh, he's gonna run over to Clint. <laughs> Don't. He had so many chances to not. Uh, title, and then as he's running over, this giant surge of mud just starts flowing in all directions. 
Uh, this is going to hit both. Uh, this is going to hit Clerk and the two uh, zombie goblins. Uh, so Clerk is a twenty-six. That definitely hits. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Hey, but what about the club? I love when yeah. you ask when it's something like twenty-six. Well, no, or something. Well, well, because there's a, there's there a lot of effects. Th yeah, yeah, there's effects. Uh, blur means unconscious. Is that correct with the with the uh, club? Uh, no. It's till the next turn. Okay, so if you take damage, that goes down, so but it's going to go back up. So my cloak's deactivated until my next turn. All which right. Which is in, you know, a uh, turn. All right, 11 points of damage. Uh, that is 93 over in your character sheet. Hopefully that linked over. Yeah, I got not. it. Okay, thanks. Uh, 93. And uh, this is also going to go to the Zombos. Here we go. Uh, critical hit on one of the goblins. And both critical hits. Man, that's a... Uh, that zombie thing was unlucky. This was worth it. Uh, They're both zombies, both zombies are still up. Uh, one zombie has three hit points left. Another one has one hit point left. Oh yeah, that's all they need. Uh, <laughs> and then this one is going to whoop, whoop, run over here. Qua, you're going to go ahead and get hit with a tidal mud. Uh, for 11, no that does not hit. Skagzag, it is your turn. All right, all right, let's see. Uh... Uh, I'm gonna work a catapult. Uh... Yes, yes, it's happening. <laughs> yeah. there's, there's lots of pondelies. <laughs> I mean, within this swampy mud, there's uh, various pebbles and rocks you can catapult. Whatever. Uh, okay. Anything. Uh, like... I do like the swamp lily idea. Okay. Cause I mean, then it's kind of like a playing card, you know, when they like slice stuff in half and they like ah, get lost. Okay. That's kind of neat. Ah. Uh, maybe it'll unlock a trait card for uh, Skagzag. Yeah. You, hit hit him with the pond lily. All right, yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, let's see, do I got to use the old D&D &D Beyond? Yes, you do. All right, let's just start it out with the old fifth level. Start out with the fifth level. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> he rolled three eights. All right. My oh, man. My man. man. I mean, he has, to, he has to hit the save still, gang. Three eights, two sixes. Fourteen oh, fails. Uh, which which uh, which one are you aiming towards? Uh, Left or right? I'm towards the closer one. All right, left. That's 41 points uh, can of damage. Can I bury the small at two? Uh, yes, you can. Uh, that is your right. 12. That's an extra 12 points of damage. Oh, what yeah. the yeah. shit? <laughs> if we hit stuff that's bigger than us, we this get... This guy's actually powerful. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> the Skagzag's always been pretty powerful. I just don't know what I'm doing. He just be another guy. guy. He, he doesn't know what he's doing. A self limiter. Like <laughs> All right, Skagzag, you still have movement remaining and a bonus action. All right. Uh. Well, I was here. I moved up like one. Yep. You still have, uh, you still have movement then. It's right, half movement up. if you go into the mud, so you get half of your regular. Like it takes uh, ten I per see. square in the mud. Uh, no, no, I'm gonna stay on this platform still. Okay. Hell yeah. And I will. Uh, I'll uh, scan you got his. Scan? Yeah, I'm gonna what, scan what would you his. Like to learn? Uh, move turn. So he'll probably oh. move pretty soon. All right, Great. move turn goes on initiative of eighteen. So let me go ahead and label that now. I'll copy it out of the D and D uh, roll twenty, bro. Thanks, man. What a guy. Move no turn. G Big Belly moves up to his movement speed. Those ten feet away from him during his movement get hit with tidal mud. Hmm. As he's just like surging through the mud. All right, are you doing any movement, Skagzag? Uh, I moved one square. That's it. All right, Clerk. This guy's an attack of opportunity kind of scumbag. Mm. I got this weird feeling about it. Fuck, but I want to. I want to scan something. Uh, decisions, decisions. To... There's a lot to scan. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to scan the magic oh, well. turn because it would be really helpful if I knew what that was to possibly cast something that would help us a lot. Yeah. If I knew. But uh. I need to disengage. Fuck. Ah! Yeah, I'm at, I have to disconnect from this guy. So I'm going to bonus action disengage. Okay. Away from him. Okay. A little ways. 
Bokeh. And uh, then I'm going to, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to unsettling word him. Okay. He is to unsettled. Yes. yes. Yes, he is unsettled. Oh wait, actually no, I take that back. That was a bonus death. action. I already disengaged. Sorry, I don't unsettling word. Oh. Uh action bad. remains. I haven't disengaged ever, dude. That never happens because I'm never near things. Uh I'm just gonna cast a I'm gonna cast a fucking I'm gonna cast a bane at these two. At the two boys. Uh okay. Wisdom save, correct? Wisdom save nineteen. Uh fails. And fails. Both of them are now baned. Minus 1d4 per roll. Is that correct? Yep. Okie dokie. That ends your round, correct? That super cute. Actually, was I standing there? I was standing. Uh, you were, yes. You, you were. Mm. Either way, I think I still have. You still have some movement. Yeah, I still have one block either way. I'm going to move one farther away. Okay. Let's uh, all right, before the hyena goes, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and roll uh, 1d4 here for this attack that's going to be this big boy slam. Okay, so one's going to be a three, one's going to subtract four. Uh, Qua, uh, Thick Chief Big Belly is going to body slam you. Uh, that is a 12, and that is a nine. Neither hit. No. Uh, this one's going to start slamming goblins. So here we go. Uh, once again, let me go ahead and roll uh, minus four and minus one. So this first one's going to be a minus four for a 12 on the zombie. Let me see what uh, kind of... No, zombie definitely gets hit. And this one just is... Sinks down dude, to the zombie, mud. Dude. <laughs> All right. For 22 points of bludgeoning damage. A giant hyena. Tis your turn. You are Can now I... in front of the corpse of uh, Princess Biggerbelly. Yeah, can and I raging. scan her? To, like, is the mud? Is there a way for us to detect if the mud thing is a Chief Big Belly boss mechanic, or is it Absolutely. anyone involved in this mud? So as you scan and observe, along with your own history of being here, even though it is a bit foggy, a bit hazy, uh, Cheezel is a bit mixed up from time to time. Um, those that rule the domain of the of the Swamp of Life has control of its powers. Chief Big Belly, the ruler of the Swamp of Life, can control its reincarnation and resurrection ability. Anyone else that dies within this mud will not be resurrected. Nice. Even if it's family? Even if it's family. family. All right, great. <laughs> um, good. I'm gonna leave her dumb, stupid body there and I'll come over here and I'll rage bite this boy. All right, this will be at an advantage. That's three bites, one. Uh, that, roll, roll again, please, for this first one. All right, 11 points of damage dealt. Um, and that, it will use the, uh, the guiding bolt. You have two more attacks. I would like to add the awesome power of my rage damage to Minus well. three, correct? Yes, plus three to the attack, yeah. All right, perfect, I will remember that. You have two more attacks Man. remaining. Uh, that's a Boop. critical miss, and 13 does not hit. Do uh, I do it once more, or does that count for both of them? Sorry. That's it. That counts for both of them. The, the Only the first attack is um, the guy you Understood. bolted one. All right. Okay. Does that end your round? Um, and then I'm going to bonus action my way. Well, you've out. already used your bonus action to scan. I'm going Just... to sit tight. Okay. Hey, gang, if you're doing movements, don't go into, like, the center here. I've got them. Okay. Uh, does, do we see anything, by the way, on Cheezle's face? Any emotion? Any, like, is he teary or is he happy? Oh, did he Cheezle? want this? It's like it the like joyful won. sneer of the happiest little <laughs> hyena you've ever seen. This wow. is all. He got to watch... Chief Big Belly eat his daughter, then explode. Nothing has made him happier. It does seem like the sort of revenge plan that a child would think up of and not realize <laughs> yeah. that it's that dark. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to point out, you guys keep saying it's dark, but you're still going along with it. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah we're, we're kind of we're, we're, we're kind of desperate. With the <laughs> Dutch tattoo on Motu, Motu's forehead, dude, all right? Yeah, I'm just yeah. saying. God damn it. 
All right. You're right. So, uh, with the giant hyena before uh, uh, Pikel goes, uh, this one casts a spell, holding its hand out over here. Uh-oh. Not as, the exit. As the stuck. mod close over the stairs. Oh. Door stuck. Door Okay. No, uh, I put something in the doorway. No, nah, actually, once the food disappears, it's like the opposite now, and it'll open it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, we, well, we have we, 24 hours until that that situation yeah. happens, right? That's a long we'll time. We'll starve before it, then. In turn order, that's like many turns. So yeah. That's um. Not... All right, and then this one's gonna hold out its hand and cast the spell Mud Rush, uh, aiming it towards the hyena. Mud Rush. As you see a giant line, allow me to draw. Uh, within Whoa. that purple line over there will be targeted, which will be the hyena. Uh, please make a dexterity save, Jesse. Okay. As giant hyena. I'm gonna have to. I can do it for you if you'd like. It's, it's all right. I got it. You got it. Uh, that is a failure. You take 26. Just kidding. You take 13 points of bludgeoning damage as you are currently raging. All right. God, fucking badass. Uh, we are now at uh, Piquel. Uh -huh, almost skipped it. Almost skipped it, oh, but I did it. Piquel. Okay. Uh, so it doesn't matter which one I attack. Is that yeah. what I'm gleaming here? Um... Yeah, functionally. Okay. It's fine for now. Um, well, first I'll scan. Okay. What would you like to learn? Um, let's find out vulnerability. All right. Vulnerability. Ahem. <clears throat> uh, first source of fire damage dealt this round to Cheap Big Belly adds vulnerability stack. Ooh. Well, that's good to know, actually. That is good to know. Is so. Sacred Flame fire? Sacred Flame, I believe, is radiant. Yeah, shoot. Okay. Um, I have Firebolt, but that's really like the worst use of my spells right now. Or I guess uh, I could I could light something on fire on my turn, oh. and then Skags I could catapult. Yeah, uh, or I can catapult the torches. Oh, or the wait, teamwork's the probably more fun. <laughs> I can't even see any torches. <laughs> uh, yeah, Brett, how is this lit? This room. Uh, if you look up into the air, you just kind of see that the the, the, the mud like cavern itself, uh, you seem to be underground somewhere. Uh, so it's not lit by torches, but it's lit by uh, daylight from above ground or from above in the ceiling. Oh, there's like a hole in the ceiling? Yes. Or there's various like thin, thinning parts of the ceiling where light right. is peering through, which is why you can see everything. Okay. Um, okay, so yeah, no torches. For my action, I will, I guess, guiding bolt the one closer to me. Okay. That hits. Awesome. Marking nice. him. 15 points of radiant damage. And advantage. Yeah. For yep, advantage has been given. Okay. Day. Does that end your round? Yes. All right. Top of the round, model. Did I hide last round or not? I don't believe you did. No. So this one wouldn't be sneak attack, so I should probably hit this guy. Um, I will uh, attack with advantage. Okay. Oops, Why are you attacking with um, advantage? Uh, cause Pickel. Uh, that this is the one that is marked with that oh. with advantage. Yes. Okay. So w what do I do here, Brett? Because that was a delicious roll. Uh, well, I mean, <laughs> you you specifically said you wanted to target the one with for sneak attack, correct? Because yeah. You so do we take the one. first roll or do yes, we do? Roll? We do take the first roll. Thirty-two Yay. hits with a critical Wonderful. hit. Nice crit. <laughs> Okay. Um, and and now I will uh let's see twenty Jesus Christ, hold on. I wish I just second. added it. That's so messy. No 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 no, it's all good. Twenty, fifteen, thirty-five, uh thirty-eight, uh forty-nine points of damage. Uh oh, also, yeah. since you have dealt sneak attack to Chief Big Belly, a hidden trait is revealed. Ooh. Behold. <laughs> I was gonna dip my knives in the mud. <laughs> Uh, you may spend uh, sneaky vulnerability. You may spend a vulnerability stack to allow you to use your sneak attack again this round. Oh yeah, hell yeah, I'll go for that. 
Um, so that's just in general in battle. So if you spend a vulnerability stack and you attack again, uh, oh, you will- Oh, I see. You mean before mm -hmm. an attack, right? Yep, yep. Well, no, so yeah. Okay. So before an attack, you go, I'm spending a vulnerability, and now yeah, I can I sneak attack again. That is correct. Sweet. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. That's um, That was my thing. I will bonus action scan spell casting. All right. Spell casting. Here we go. Uh, goes on initiative of six. Big Belly casts Mud Rush. And Mud Rush is uh, literally a 90 foot line by token size. So it's 90 foot uh, length by, uh, in this case, 10 foot width. Okay. Dexterity DC 16. It deals a total of 5d12 bludgeoning damage. Down. Okay. Spell casting round has been added on an initiative of six. Uh, do you move at all? Uh, no, that's my turn. All right, Qua, it's your turn. All right. Um, I'm going to gamble on this one. I'm just going to cast a sixth level um, light. <laughs> okay. Because it does 10 eight of damage, assuming it hits. And I'm uh, hoping that that'll hit for 80. It could hit for not that. <laughs> Let's give it a whirl. All right. Who are you targeting? Uh, the one closest to me. Okay. Blight. Uh, you cast a spell of Blight. A constitution save needs to be made. Uh, does Bane subtract from saving throws to me? Yes. All right. Uh, I'll roll, double uh, check just to be 100% sure. I'll roll a uh, 1d4 while you're checking. Saving throws. Yep. Yep. All right. Rolling a constitution, subtracting four from this. Cool. With an 11, uh, you deal 45 points of damage. As you inflict the damage upon Chief Big Belly, you will see his body wither and evaporate away. A husk of mud, almost as if hit with a flame, uh, like a ceramic clay statue, as he will then crumble into the mud. One belly okay. remains. Oh, okay. That was easy. We should um, get an above board count on this guy when we have enough scans. To then do. I will bonus action uh, scan for. You can ask for meta information now. You scan for three things. Health. 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 Oh. Health. 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 All right. Scanning for health. Here we are. Bing. Oh, easy as. Y'all think he just gets weaker and more numerous as time goes no. on, making this worse and worse? No. Uh. This I mean, one's that's the final strong. one, and then he dies. Yeah, y'all might <laughs> oh. want to get onto the bridges. Oh, yeah. This might be inside a big belly. It looks belly-ish. I'm all right. Okay. I think we done got eight, turn. dude. Wait, we need to do our other trade cards, too. Uh, Qua, you have a boobit remaining. Is there anything else you'd like to do? I'll get out of the mud. Okay, dude. We done got eight. Right. I thought you meant the number. I was like, yeah. what the fuck did he say <laughs> I, that I for? I was saying, I think we done got eight. Yeah, we done got eight, boy. Done sure. got eight. Wait All right. It. That ends your round. Move turn. I'm going to roll a 1d3. With a three, uh, he's going to cycle the through the Hell mud. yeah. Beat the shit out of that. Wait, no, no. Let's go to vodka. <laughs> vodka. All right. <laughs> no, uh bro. Three, uh, four people are going to be hit with uh, Tidal Mud. Uh, I believe zombies uh -oh. do not have That's reactions. Well. Let me look into it. Uh, I wouldn't think they would. Uh, oh, no, I'm thinking roll. Or, uh, yes, they, well, yes, they, they act do. on a bonus turn. Oh, okay. If yeah, you they issue act... no commands, the creature defends itself. Oh, I mm -hmm. guess. And your, that your command was move and attack, so I would say it does not have the reactions. No, to... but I didn't give them an order this turn. No, you did not. So they are defending themselves, which means they are not. I don't not... know if op, attack of ops are defending themselves, but I don't no, know. No, they are not. Uh, attacks of op would be more strategic as the uh, the zombies themselves would be, uh, yeah, doing everything they can to defend themselves. Not it's fine. I'm tired of playing with these zombies anyway. Just I'm kill them. I'm bored of them. <laughs> I'm bored of them. Just kill them. Uh, that hits, hits uh, Skagzag for 14 uh, to hit Skagzag. Oh, I... I'm going to need some Banes in there. Uh, absolutely. Well, Skagzag, it, it doesn't hit. And, um, uh, Pikel, a, nope, ignore that. Uh, title, Mud. Okay, Mud Rush is at point blank. 23 for Pikel, which means I have okay. to roll a 1e3. All right, so I'm rolling some Banes. I'm going to start with the top. A 10 becomes a 6, that misses. A 21 becomes a 20, that hits. A 14 becomes a 10, that misses. And the 23 becomes a 21, which will still hit Mikkel. All right, 
drag my damn group stuff there, guys. I'm sorry. 12 points of bludgeoning damage to... Hey, hold on. Was that vodka that got hit? Vodka got hit for 20... Uh, yep. 12 points of damage to the vodka zombie. And then... Pikel's going to take 6 points of damage. Okay. Down to 106 HP. Yeah. Oh. Okie dokie. Uh, Skagzag, it is now your turn. All right, let's, uh... <laughs> Do it. Hit him with the old uh, catapult. But uh, I'm going to pull out uh, the uh, one torch. Oh, God. Yeah, one right. torch what? remains. Or is I, that have, like... I have three torches. So, so one torch out... of the three. <laughs> I'm gonna take one out. All right. I'm gonna catapult it out. Do I have to light this torch? Oh, uh, yes, you do. You'll have to use that as part of your movement action, Bonus. too. <laughs> yep. All right. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay. Bonus action and then action. You can now catapult the torch. Excellent. Here we go. Let's do a four, uh, fourth level here. Okay. E Okay, so a dexterity save. Let me go ahead and roll this bane. Uh, oh. Okay, subtracting one. Eh. A 10. Oh. That hits, dealing 34 points of bludgeoning damage. Uh, Chief Big Belly will go down into the mud. Again, the flame will hit. It will dry into a husk of his former self and then crumble down. We won! It's over! Woo! Gags Alas. in. Uh, is there? You have a move. You have movement action remaining. I thought I used my move. Or was that the bonus action? You used your bonus, and you used your action. You have movement okay. remaining if you'd like to use it. Uh, no, nah, I like this platform. Okay, Clark. Uh, Clark's gonna prepare since there's no one here. Uh, he, I'm going to say he prepares a firebolt for the first thing that comes out of the mud. Excellent. Uh, for his turn, and okay. he will just sort of hang out. All right. Unless I can scan while they're underground. Uh, there can is nothing I still do a scan? There is nothing to scan at this time. Oh. I was going to ask about, like, I guess you can't scan condition immunity, so it doesn't say it right. Yeah, if if uh, if, it, if it is not labeled condition immunities, it does not have a, an immunity to conditions. Epic. Okay, then, yeah, that's it. Okay. Uh, giant hy hyena. This is your turn. I am gonna, uh, can I move to here and then hold action? Uh, yes, what action would you like to hold? Uh, my triple bite on some boy who pops up. If Okay, sounds good. That uh, would presumably only be if they're in melee range if you right? That is correct. I mean, that's all I can do anyway, so. Yeah, that's true. It works. Um, because you do not take damage, you will lose range, rage this round. Uh, peek out. Um, I will hold a third level guiding bolt in preparation for the next thing popping up. All right. Top of the round, you will see a big chunk of mud uh, begin to bubble up as a larger chief big belly erupts. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, come on. It's still not a lot of HP, so something's happening. Okay. That's not a lot of you. Model. Oh, it does. And oh, this one does not have. One second. Let me go ahead and mark so there's no confusion. Uh, this one does not have Bane, nor does it have the mark of the. There. But all the. Uh, at this point, everyone's actions should go off. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're good as well. Let's see it. That's a critical miss on the guiding bolt. Anything else you'd like to do? Um. No, I mean, that was all I had planned, so. Okay, and, uh, doesn't have Lucky. She's not uh, a medicine. gotcha. No. And Clark. Yeah, not a medicine. <laughs> yep, fire bolt at him. Uh, Oof. 12 does not hit. Anything else you'd, you'd like to do, Lucky, uh, anything like it. that? All right, top of the round, model. Mm, model seeing a guiding bolt slam into the wall away and a fireball fucking hit the other wall. Uh, <laughs> Bloody hell, guys. And then I'm going to shoot my bow and... And hopefully not also fuck it up. 
Okay. 17 mm. hits. Yeah. All right. Uh, 11, Whatever, six, you're way closer. Uh, 22, 22 over there. 17, 22. Uh, sorry, my brain. 17. Plus well, would it even have sneak attack? 39. Oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, 17. Minus 17. Yeah. Um, and then I will use my action to scan. We haven't done the action turn, tauntable, or condition superiority, right? Tauntable seems pretty important with how big he's getting. Uh, I think I have a functional understanding of tauntable, but it might be different from last thing. So I'll, I'll do tauntable. All right. Chief Big Belly focuses attacks on those who have the taunted condition. To gain the taunted condition, you can spend your bonus action to taunt the enemy. So and once like you do, one. yeah, once you do, you gain the taunted condition until the end of your next round. If someone else attempts to taunt, uh, gain the taunted condition, you will lose your taunt. Only one person in the party can have the taunted condition at once. Okay. Um, um, if he, yeah, and if he can attack uh, the person with the taunted, he will. Um, if he cannot, he will attack someone else. Which means someone will need to be within range. 30, 35, 40. Okay. Uh, that's my, all my movement, my bonus action, and my action. So that's my turn. All right, Kwa. Uh, would you like to go? Or would you like Chief Big Belly to use his movement turn? No, I'm going first, Chief I'm Big Belly. I'm going first. Don't even think about it. Okay. Um, I'm going to cast. I've never cast this spell before. Uh, I'm going to try out Cloud Kill. Okay. I'm We're inside. Da -da -da. <laughs> <laughs> and. Uh, I'm going to be casting it at a fifth level. Okay. Uh, bada bluey. That's not very good damage. Um, oh. it is a 20 foot radius sphere of poisonous yellow green fog. Okay. Hey, you guys like fog? Oh, yeah. Woo. -hoo. He fog, succeeds. Yeah. He Woo. succeeds, you say. Uh, half damage. Okay. Uh, what's the radius um, again, please? 20 foot radius. And foot then uh, at the radius, start of my yikes. radius. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. Need and then at the start of my turn, it moves ten feet. Um, I'm gonna need you away from me. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna need you to first tell me where the hell yeah, you want to put I'll that. Yeah, see, I'll figure it out. Yeah, Let's see um, here. <laughs> Let's see, uh, ten feet away from me. Yeah, that's pretty good. That'll buy me some time. <laughs> All right. Yep. Okay, so you said he's gonna take half damage. All right, let me go and roll that. Okie dokie. Uh, Qual, does that end your round? Uh, I will bonus action scan. What have we not learned? Uh, condition superiority. Condition superiority. While conscious at the top of the round, any ongoing effect that requires a save or a condition can be ended. Hmm. All right. Um, I'm gonna stand my ground laws. Okay, it's cloud kill. I'm assuming is if, I, if he ends his turn within the cloud, uh, he takes additional damage. When a correct. creature enters the spell for the first turn, uh, time on a turn or starts its turn there, that creature starts his turn. Ooh, baby, no. that's 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 delicious. All right, go and roll that cloud kill. It's now his turn. Oh uh, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Wait. Very that's cool. It. That's not the damage. Very well. You did a wisdom save as well. I don't know what the hell you. Clicked. I think I clicked the wrong spell. Yes, you did. All right. Oh, is I that a confusion? <laughs> All right. Is that an eighteen? All right. Let's see what we yes, got. So. Uh, he fails, taking eighteen points of poison damage, and then is going to, let's see, uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. God, this, skag -skag. this is what real fog looks like. Oh my god. Yeah, god, he's trying to move through. He's fucking massive. Uh, I mean, I've, uh, I've done some poison fog before, actually. He actually has. All right. Oh, okay. uh, Tidal yeah. mud over to. <laughs> to model. Yo. Uh, this is going to be a 24 to hit. That definitely hits. All right. Dealing a total of 18 points of bludgeoning damage. I'm going to half that with my reaction. Mm, okay. All right, 103. <laughs> maybe maybe not. Ah, I'd rather you didn't, dude. I don't think you yeah. need it. Going to uh, do that. Okay. 103. Okie dokie. Uh, Skagzag. All right. Um, now the option here. 
Catapult. 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 Or move catapult. So we're going to move. Okay. Then we're going to catapult. Okie dokie. What are you catapulting? Uh, I'm going out. <laughs> catapult yourself into his and mouth then or something. Him and then blow up. I don't know. Blow up, that would be blow up. Fun. Grow big. I, I wish I was an big. Ape. Are you a wizard? Can you uh, do cool things? Nah, he's just a slave no. to the catapult meta and always oh. has been. Yeah. <laughs> it's just what it is. It is what it is. Some people wish they had catapults. Some people do the catapult, you know? Yeah, Dude, I that's the two types of people. Guy, right? <laughs> uh, go ahead and roll your catapult. What are you catapulting? I'm going to do another torch. So that'll be my can... bonus action. All right, bonus I've action. I've down to one action. torch. All right, let's see that catapult at what level? Uh, This is going to be my other level five. So I'm out of them now. Okay. Boom. All right, 37 points of damage. Go and do a deck save. This thick boy gets hit for 37 points of damage. And Can I reroll any of the ones. Are there any ones in there? Uh, if you mouse over, it shall tell you you have one two remaining. Or actually, you have two twos remaining. Would you like to reroll right. them? All right. I would. Roll uh, slash roll space 2d6. We will subtract four from whatever you roll. All right. And he gains a vulnerability stack. Um, all right. Uh, an extra five points of damage. Nice. Okay, Wait, I haven't done any magic rolls. Well, you have. I was about to say, please roll. This guy's uh, about to implode. <laughs> please roll 3d20s. <laughs> He's got Dude. some pent up wild magic. Is oh, that is. I was about to figure oh, out why no. you don't stand near Skagzak, dude. Uh, oh. Four is nothing. 18 is nothing. And please roll a 1d100, please. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, actually, I'm sorry. Uh, roll uh, 1d100 twice. Whoa. Oh. 33 and 24. So the following, uh, your skin turns a vibrant shade of blue or <laughs> uh, maximize the damage of the next damaging spell you cast within the next minute. Oh my God. Um, what the fuck? Blue skin. Blue skin. I think blue skin sounds blue like skin, it's really in right skin. now. Blue skin does sound in. Now when we're talking maximize damage, we're talking like. You yep. still have your level six, right? No, uh, he used his level six on her catapult, I believe. Uh, I don't have. Wait, level I have level five. I have level five, so I don't even have a level six. You don't have level six spells? Oh, that's right. He doesn't. No, no he's a warlock. Oh. Yeah. So, uh, so maximize means if you do a catapult at level four, let's say, um, yeah. it's it assumes that you rolled max damage on uh, all the dice. Oh. Uh, hey, give me the blue skin. All right. Well, hell yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> Unsurprising, he becomes blue. Oh, you can take you can take the red off of me. Oh, you don't want to be red anymore. This guy's is long since dropped. <laughs> All right. Uh, please roll a one d twenty. Skag Uh, wait. Roll another d twenty. Yes, please. All right, seven. Uh, permanent feather beard has been deleted. It is now replaced with blue skin. Well, permanent? Yeah. Huh? Permanent blue skin? Uh, yes. Nice. Uh, just so you know, your skin turns a vibrant shade of blue permanently until you get a uh, removed curse cast upon you. <laughs> yeah, we don't do that here. Oh, don't yeah. do that. Which, which means more than likely, uh, you're f in the finale, you will have blue skin. Hell yeah. All right. Uh, Skagzag, uh, I believe that ends your round, correct? Correct. All right. Learnt. Learnt's kind of we, have, we haven't hit this guy with any fire stuff, have we? Uh, you hit no, one uh, with the torch. Hit with one. Oh, yes. yeah, we yeeted a torch. Yeah. Uh, I'm like, gang, I'm getting wigged out by this guy's deal. There's something too easy about this right now, and it's making me really fucking uncomfortable. I don't know if I want to spend any crazy slots to do big damage on a guy. What? I've already burned all of my slots. Yeah, I know, which means I don't want to burn mine too. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Uh, I'm just gonna... Hang on. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna vicious mockery him for now and just give him disadvantage on the next attack roll. I feel like the DPS gang could do 100 damage a lot faster than me participating in that when I could instead just save my stuff. All right, let's see him do a wisdom saving throw. Uh, that's a fail. He gets the vicious mockery. Yeah, he'll have disadvantage on this attack. On his uh, on his next attack roll. Yep. Perfect. <laughs> and he will take six points of psychic damage. Anything else you'd like to do? Uh, well, look, we just so we're all like aware, we kill him one more time and he comes up with six instability. He'll be having a plus six on everything he does. And if we kill him one more time, he's dead. So I think like, you know, we just get ready to blast him when that happens, right? I mean, like, I feel like we're doing so much damage that's gonna happen in the next cycle, yeah? I don't think there's anything else to do. Right all now. right, but giant hyena, it's your turn. As a friendly reminder, uh, Jesse, you are not raging anymore. Right. No, I'm trying to see. I can. Oh wait, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm gonna stop you right there. Uh, it's actually Chief uh, Big Belly's turn. Uh, please give me a cloud kill. Qual? Oh yeah. That's me. Uh, cloud kill. What did I cast that fifth level? I believe so. Yeah, Scanning there up. It yep, is. Yes, you did. Fifth level. All right, 28 poison. Uh, he succeeds, which means he will take 14 points of poison damage. And that cloud killed him. That's fucking mileage. Doing it. It's doing it. Doing the work. Yeah. That is a strong fucking. Honestly, I expected him to just, like most AoE spells I cast, they walk out of it in one turn and then go, well, but he's uh, a he's... concentration. Yeah, he's thick. He's thick. All right, now it is, uh, uh, oh yeah. And then uh, he will now, ba 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 bo looking at his character sheets. Chief Big Belly. Uh, okay, uh, he's going to attack uh, with a giant mud ball. Allow me, uh, and just gonna do a 10 foot area so I can see exactly, or a 10 foot radius, excuse me. Be killed, no. <laughs> Skag's uh -oh. like, no, please. Oh. Ah. The warg also, no. Oh, no, <laughs> actually not the warg, no. Uh, oh, no. actually, most targets play as possible. All right, giant hyena. No, not vodka and other one. No, not them. Uh, I need a dexterity save from everyone in that area. So giant hyena. Uh, please, uh, please use the dexterity save at the giant hyena. So select the hyena and click the saving throw. All right. They have much less dexterous. Oh boy, this is broken as all hell. Uh, so hold on one second. I'm gonna have to roll manually for the zombos. I oh, they roll at a they roll at a negative two. I can't, can't believe Fodka is dead. <laughs> kill them. They've been nothing but trouble ever since I raised. Well, them. look, this made them helpful right now. What happened? Fourteen and six. Good God, it all broke. I'm gonna have to do the mud ball again because it's it just... all right. No, no, no. Look, they failed, so they, they get hit for 34 damage and die it. instantly. 23 <laughs> points of damage to hyena, and then yeah, that will actually kill all all of them. No, please, <laughs> please, God, please. But vodka, my brother. Everyone I bring back dies. All right, uh, Jesse, it's now your turn with the giant hyena. Okay, um. If I'm a, if I'm big, can I get, make it to, to here and still be in attack range? Uh, your reach as a giant hyena. Sorry, I'm, I'm Does that take, this takes me to 20. Looking at your character sheet now. Your reach is five feet. So no, you have to be within five feet. Maybe just taunt him to you or something. Stay on the bridge. 
Yep, your movement, but your movement speed is uh, 50 feet, so you can move five squares. Oh, lovely. That's the plan then. And I will, I think I still have plenty of rage. So much rage, yeah. I am also gonna subtract four more points from there. You actually have five hit points. Oh, just infinitely rage once more. Okay, you are raging. And three bite his butt. Let's see it. One bite. Uh, uh, miss. Two bite. Uh, hit for 12, uh, 15. Hits for 13. Great. Add that end your round. Sit tight. Yes. All right. Spell, spell casting around. Looking around. Uh, is going to cast uh, Mud Rush. Drawing the area. I'm actually going to draw it in a bright red so you guys can see this. Uh, everyone in this area is going to get hit, which means only the hyena. Oh, yeah, it is going to be scarier when it gets bigger. <laughs> Mud Rush. Uh, DC's gonna be 20 dexterity, please. For the hyena. Mm-hmm. If you select your token and then press I the did. Save. Did it not work? Uh, I didn't see anything. Well, I can you work. can... Yeah, I can. Yeah, please do. Uh, seven, no, you're good. Uh, you fail, uh, taking five points of damage, and then Cheezle's gonna return back. Um, oh, I'm sorry, uh, eight points of damage, fail, three. Uh, so a Cheezle's gonna come back with uh, three points of damage dealt. Uh, where would, of these, uh, of these four squares, where would you like Cheezle to be? Right there's fine. Okay, so you don't want to be in melee range, is that correct? Nope. Okay. Uh, as you revert back to form, uh, you will see Chief uh, Big Belly look down at you, uh, and he squints for a moment as he sees someone familiar. He will then... Jesus, I should have known! As he stares down at you. The jig is Diesel up. Diesel grins with the been widest white-toothed, most awful smile. All right. Pikeld, it's your turn. All right. Um, let's see. Guiding Bolt hasn't failed me yet, except for that one time. Except for literally failure. last round. Um, <laughs> many documented okay, well, times. That's, <laughs> it, when it does work, it's really good, though. So it's yes. Weird. So I'm going to Guiding Bolt. Uh, here we go. More like unguided bolt recently. That hits. Right. Nice. Get him. Leave it in the Twitch chat, Eric. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Sixteen points of damage to Chief Big Belly. Perfect. Beautiful. Um, wait, have we scanned for everything though? I don't think we've done action turn, have we? I'll scan for action turn if we haven't. All right, action turn is one. the following. Badoosh. Chief Big Belly attacks with two body slams. If there's no one in melee, Chief Big Belly instead attacks with a mud ball. Cool. Good job. All right. Pikel, does that end your round? Yes. Model, it is your turn. Are you... Are you... Um, You're not within five feet of him, are you, Chisel? Or like... Nope, no Chisel is not um, within five feet. No. However, he does have, uh, you have advantage uh, marked on him if you hit, which will proc sneak attack. Oh, hell yeah. No, I'll totally just hit with advantage then. Um, doop -a -doop -a -doo. 23 hits. Okay. He also, uh, 14, 5, oh, sorry, 19. I use the vulnerability stack. Sorry, that was the whole point. Is that okay it, now or is it Nope, late? it is not. You have to declare it before you roll the hit. I'm sorry. Okay. That's my no, that's my fault. Thirty-eight points of damage. He is down to eleven. It's okay. Well, He's dead. no, yeah, it, it it should be for Qua. This is his backstory, I think. Well, so. we still have to kill him one more time. Oh yeah. All right. Well, six I'm gonna use my movement. Oh, so, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll run away, and there's nothing left to scan, right? That's all of them, Brett. Uh, that is correct. 
Cool. Okay, that's my... I'm going to use my bonus action to hide, I guess? Can I hide uh, here? Yeah, so you're going to like try and get some mud on you. Go ahead and give me that stealth. Cover myself in mud. All right, 19. Model, that ends your turn. Wah, would you like to go, or would you like his movement to go? <laughs> Wait, his movement? Let him go! Come if, on, would he that hasn't trigger, done anything. Would that trigger cloud kill? Yes, it would. Yeah, I'll let him go first. Okay, <laughs> go ahead and roll your cloud kill. Uh, if, it doesn't, no. if it doesn't, I don't care. But if it does, easy peasy. He succeeds. It still does. Uh, <laughs> but he is dealt 14 points of damage as the poison will now just completely dissolve him away into the mud. Nice. Okay, uh, Quad is now your turn. <laughs> as you see, Chief Big Belly just fall <laughs> apart into the mud poison. I'm going to ready a level five blight on oh. wherever he pops out. Okay. Uh, Skagzag, it is your turn. All right. Um, everyone prepare their salvo. Oh, yeah. I'm going to cast Fog. All yes. right. <laughs> No, he, what? this is the, the this trait card. Man. This oh activates God. the hidden trait of fog. Whoa. Hero. Muddy fog. Whoa. When the fog spell is cast in battle, the area of the spell is replaced with walls of mud. Each square can be dug through with a strength check of DC 13 Whoa. and double movement. Where are you oh casting the God. fog? Uh, I'm going to cast it. <laughs> in case uh, Cheezle, like, kill him. Probably. Kill him. Crush him. <laughs> ah. Take his life. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait. You couldn't if you tried. You, uh, Eric, do you understand blue what it's Blue idiot. What's uh, <laughs> big blue I he was dummy. Just come up Can't from say the ground, that about his skin. Right? Yeah, it makes uh, it what like, it what makes level, it like uh, solid. What level of fog yeah. are you casting? Uh, Probably just level uh, poo. Uh, I thought you said level poo. Um, <laughs> okay, 20 <laughs> foot, 20 foot. All right, so this is a 40 foot fog. One second. Damn. That's a big fog. That's a big fog. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. I could block people in, couldn't I? What if he just gets stranded on top All of All right. It? Please place oh where you'd like to throw the fog. <laughs> Let's do <laughs> oh right God. here. Okay. Nice. Uh, so as the fog manifests itself, uh, the mud will raise up as you now see a giant dome of mud in that area. Oh that's a solid wall. Huh, well, that's where... Uh, that's 40 yeah. feet high at its peak. <laughs> yep, huge. that is correct. Why? <laughs> Why not? It's beautiful. It's geometric. Um, um, oh, that's, uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and... and, and that looks it. like uh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's like mud. <laughs> it's like mud or something. Yeah. All right, I'm going to put that there so it's a little brighter. Okay. Uh, please roll a 1d20. All right. Uh, that is a nine. Nothing happens. Okay, Skagzag, is there anything else you'd like to do? No, I'm pretty content with it. All right, Clarent. Clarent uh, is going to move here. Hmm? I don't think I can reach. I was going to Bardic Inspire someone for that, you know, good, good buff. I don't think... Hang on, I'm trying to see if there's like a range, because I'd rather Bardic Inspire... I'll Bardic Inspire Cheese. Let's. I'm going to give Cheese a good old inspiration. Thank charge. you so much. No problem. And uh, then I am going to prepare for this guy's fucking appearance uh, by preparing to cast Synaptic Static the second he comes up. And Qua, I would like to ask that I cast it before your cast. Oh, for what it's worth, he might even be able to in range of me. Well, if we can see Mine's him, a thirty foot let spell. me let me throw out my spell first because it will debuff his saves. Okay. And that'll be my turn. Okay. Sorry, doing a little math. Uh, okay. Uh, next up is Cheezel. Um, I would like, so, so Brett, I just want to ask you a question. Yeah, please. Is the mud, we're in water-based mud? Blood-based. It's, it's mud. 
It's blood mud. Right, but but would you consider it water-based mud? What blood are you trying to dirt. do? And I'll uh, I'll let you know <laughs> what, you, what it is. Yeah. Well, it's well, according to the uh, Oklahoma State University, water-based mud is roughly eight <laughs> percent solids, which means the rest <laughs> is water. Okay. And uh, Cheezle has the ability to shape water, and I'm curious <laughs> if I can use that to bring the entire dome crashing down on uh, Chief Big Bell if he pops up in the dome. But that mud's like not water mud. Does it? Like he kind of like the mud. He's into it. Wouldn't that empower him? Also, Action. your uh, your shape water is a five foot square, so you can control the water <laughs> of a well, five foot cube of the, uh, right, the mud. But, but time out, time out. A five foot cube solidified falling from forty feet. That's death. That's death. That is actually he would pretty die. painful, probably. Yeah. Yes. Maybe. That's a painful way to go. Just put it out there. You should probably look that up on Oklahoma. I like I like I like where your head's at. I like where your head's at. I mean, Pop. I can't do anything except sit tight. So okay. I mean, unless he pops up right next to me. Uh, fine. We'll just I'll just wait and yes, ready so action to around. attack. Okay. Uh, actually, Cheezle's gonna slap himself to keep his rage up. Okay. Make him roll. Yeah, can I punch you myself? Gotta make him roll. Come on. Make him roll. Uh, can you punch yourself to what? Oh, yeah, absolutely. So, so what is your unarmed strength damage? Uh, it's a great life What is question. your strength modifier? My strength modifier is plus three. All right. If you'd like to inflict three damage upon yourself, uh, you can maintain I would love your rage. To. All right. Yes. You'll be dealt three points of damage, which with, uh, yep, minus three. Um, to maintain your rage, which would actually go uh, down to one because you're raging. Uh, so you take one point of damage <laughs> and you maintain your rage. Okay, Face. yeah, I'm just ready. Let's bring this fool out. Let's kill this idiot. That works. If you're spending an action to do it. Yeah, absolutely. Are you spending your action to maintain your rage? Yes. Okay, so you can't r prepare an action. Is that correct? I'm fine. Okay. All right. Peek out. Uh, ready, guiding bolt. <laughs> Okie dokie. We're gonna turn this guy into red mist for the second he comes yeah, out. Yeah, that's the, the plan. That's the yeah. All right. Top of the round. We already did it once, dude. True. You see a you see a giant area of mud begin to bubble. How how, how giant? He's probably over there. As a, oh, yeah. as a giant sheep <laughs> oh! big belly erupts oh, out. Oh my god. Uh, oh my god. He's vibrating. Uh, his, uh, all, all the scanned uh, actions that you did to learn his turns are now null and void. He has new turns. Oh, shit. Model, it is your turn. Uh, he wait, does not. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he also. What about, uh, our prepared mm -hmm. stuff that we all. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. I'm going to cast Synaptic Static. Okay. So he's got to do a DC 19 on intelligence. All right. He, he rolls. Fails. Yep. So for the next minute, uh, he has to roll a D6 and subtract it from all his attack and ability checks, as well as constitution uh, saving throws to maintain concentration. All right. Uh, he can make an intelligent saving throw at the end of any of his turns to get rid of the effect. Uh, okay. Sounds good. Um, and he takes 22 points of list? psychic damage. Yes. There's my guiding bolt. Uh, that hits, dealing 13 points of damage. Nice. And he is marked. Next attack has a uh, advantage. Sweet. Co uh, do we have a new new list for the new scannable things? Once you do your uh, bonus action to scan, absolutely. First scan. Okay, got you. Stupid out of range giant monster. Dude, this guy's going to crush me. Oh, my God. His turn starts. Skag's egg. What have you done to me? Skagzag really did just fuck you up, huh? <laughs> I have to move. Wait, uh, you just... Is it my turn, bruh? Uh, it, did everyone use their readied actions? Yeah. I All right, so, yeah. model, it is your turn. 5, 10, 15. Um, can I walk on this tile or is it too covered? Uh, it is covered in mud, so no, you cannot. Okay. Okay. You can, however, use your strength to tear into it if you'd like and then spend double All movement right. to move that square. No, that would be a and terrible And Skagzak spend his uh, turn getting rid of his big 20, fucking mess he made? 30, Unfortunately, 40. no. That is a permanent effect in the battlefield. 
Oh, he's just that in range That creates another permanent effect by creating uh, another at, fog. As I have state, as the muddy fog has stated, when the fog spell is cast in battle, the area of the spell is replaced with walls of mud. Each square can be dug through with a strength check, DC 13, and double we, movement. But there can be multiples, scatter. right? Okay. I, 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 have, I All I can do is read off what the effect does. You can choose Yeah, but there can be works. multiples, right? We don't, don't know. <laughs> uh, I'm going to use. Yeah, uh, but there could be. I'm going to use right? advantage on my bow from guiding bolt, and I'm going to use vulnerability stack and sneaky vulnerability. He has no. Uh, so he does not have a vulnerable stack anymore because this technically is a new one. However, he oh, has six right. unstable charges. You can replace an unsta uh, stable char uh, an unstable stack with a vulnerability, but then he gains a stable stack, uh, which will further buff him. Would you like we to do that? Like or you just gotta kill him. I just. I'm so I think of the power. We he's so <laughs> close to being dead. Like my number would be eight. larger than it usually is. Oh, do like, it. Think about that for a second. All right, I'll just do a regular shot. Okay. Uh, twenty-six hits. Skadoosh. For eleven, four, fifteen, eighteen, uh, thirty-three points of damage. Hell yeah! And then um, bonus action scan. Okay. Uh, the new turns that you can scan for will be action turn, concentration turn, and execution turn. Execution turn. All right. The final execution turn goes initiative of one. Chief Big Belly submerges with a tidal body slam, attacking in a line either to the east or west of him with a 500 foot length by token size of width. He emerges yeah. in a different location on the map. And by the way, oh, tidal please. body slam does the following. Oh, it's not titled Ball. I'm sorry. Yeah, I renamed the attack. It's called Big Belly Cannonball. Okay. That's amazing. There you oh, go. Yeah. Hey, you guys got to move. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys got to move. <laughs> okay. That That's my turn. Thanks, bro. <laughs> yep, you're welcome. Uh... Oh, sorry. I have to read something because I didn't... Uh, ba, 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 ba. Let's see. One uno momento. Uh, Big Belly Cannonball's dex dex save. Uh, save for half. There'll be a dex save. Uh, the DC would be 22. Okay. And if you succeed, you still take half damage. Okay. Uh, model, are you done? That's my turn. All right. Before Quag goes, this heavy arm will hmm ooh this is this is fun well I'm gonna roll a 1d2 one is Clarent two is Pikel Pikel alright Pikel a yeah, giant up? arm is going to body slam you oh good uh 21 to hit minus uh, a d6 oh oh Wait. and that will actually be a 17 that does not hit. Then you are good, as the heavy oh. arm will break down uh, into the into the bridge. All right, quads. Now your turn. Um, I'm going to cancel concentration on this poison cloud. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because I will be recasting <laughs> cloud kill. Okay. Uh, way over here on him. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and reappear. Go ahead and place it where you'd like it to be. All right, we're just gonna put that that there that thing right on there. On there now, right there. Put that right down there. Yeah, there okay. Now. And uh, now make it your save. All <laughs> right, they will be a failed save. 19 that points of be poison. Uh, 19 damage there. And uh, I will bonus action scan. Four concentration have, turn. Yeah, concentration turn sounds good. All right, so let me go ahead and first I have to remove a couple of things from the initiative. Quest to not mislead you. Concentration will be on an initiative of ten. Um, he casts mud ball. Is what happens on the concentration turn. Oh, which you've already seen. What makes it like concentration? Uh, he does it every round. And He's really focused on it. Execution turn goes on initiative of one. 
Okay. Uh, Qua, is there anything else you'd like to do? Nope. I'm all right. Okie dokie. Gagzag. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, I'm gonna try. Uh, I'm gonna do a level one fog here. Okay. Let me go in. What is wrong with him? <laughs> uh, also, you you two, and I guess, model, it's too late for you. Uh, uh, where would you like to uh, cast the fog? By the execution. Um, fuck. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Probably like right uh all right, uh, if I do this, can we still, like, hit him? Like that? Yep. So this guy, like, is... He's, like, he, would, he would be taller than the, uh, than the, the fog area. You're basically just coating him in mud. That might be fun, though. Yeah, you're gonna die, though. It is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna do that. All right. Then, I'm gonna run into the mud down here. Okay. Does that end your round? Uh, do I have to do a D20? Yes, you do. Nothing happens on an 18. All right. Okay, Clark. Uh, Clark's got unsettling words, the boy. Okay. It's time properly. I'm already, I guess, in an okay position. I'm gonna slide a little bit more this way, though. Uh, and I am going to cast. Uh, oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna cast uh, confusion at the okay. fort. DC 19. All right. Let's see. Uh, fails. He will now be confused. That's good. Uh, question. Uh, let me see something real quick. What was the last one you said? Synaptic, uh... Yeah, that doesn't use concentration. Okay, does not. Perfect. You got it. Uh, yeah, he is considered confused. Nice. He is confused along with the synaptic, uh, stat. Oh, yes. Okay. I've, I've done did him dirty. Big, big, Days, de really. big deep off area. Yeah. All right, Clark, is there anything else you'd like to do? Uh, what else do we still need to do with, uh... I mean, I did my bonus action. I'm done. Yeah. Okay. Cheezle. If I attack him, does he lose his confusion? No. No. Just don't stand in front of, like, these blocks. You'll get hit by his execution. There's so safe. Like, There's safe. What would you consider a taunt? Is that a bonus action? That is your bonus action, Sorry, which I means have to he, will, he will target you. Is okay. that still effective right now? For taunting? Absolutely. Taunt face, because it's not in the... Uh... You're taunting well, until someone face. else takes right. 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 He still, he still, he still shares taunt. the same traits. He just okay. lose, he lost all the turn, the, the new oh, turns. All right, all right. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. this is butts. All right. I'm going to move to here, use my bonus action. No, not my bonus. My uh, Are you using my your... action to move. Okay, so you, you encountered for the double movement, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then I'm going to sit here. I'm going to bonus action taunt so he attacks me. Okay. You guys need Can to we... move off of this line. You're going to get executed. Yeah. In, Which one. line? The, the line directly in East front of him. And West and West. His entire Here's body this line. line. Yeah. Like you, if you stand there, you're going to take a gigantic amount no. of damage. Well, then here's oh, yeah. fine. I still, yeah, the movement get, doesn't matter at that point. Here's how, much, uh, how much movement do you have? I have 40. So, and you're using your action, which 10. means that so you can move up to 40. Oh, 40 feet. Yeah. All right. And, you, yeah. and that and that was enough space, correct? And 20. Stay, if that line is there, I'm going to be on the opposite side of it. I don't know if you're going to be able to hit that 80 from where you were at prior. How much How much movement were you, were, were you over here once you arrived there? I mean, couldn't you move up to here instead? Mm -hmm. Like the spot. I mean, that's fine. Whatever. Rather than diagonal, because I think that's burning the movement. Okay. Okay. That works. Um, I would say move over I here so wanna... you're not in the cloud kill. Yeah, I'm just trying to stay out of the cloud and stay out of the uh, effect of his yeah, ability. There's a, there's a lot happening. Right? Yeah. There's, yeah, a yeah. Lot. there's a lot. There's a lot of, of circles. Things. 
I just yep. want to make sure that no one gets exploded at turn one. And All good. Yeah. You, you know what I'm excited for? I'm excited for him to run face first into this giant orb <laughs> and hurt himself, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Sheasel, you spent that minute and you're using your bonus action to taunt. Correct. Okay. Uh, you're going to drop rage. Is that okay? That's fine. All right, rage has been dropped. You now have. You are now taunted. Uh, he's gonna go ahead and cast mud ball. He's gonna roll his confusion. Is it oh his yeah, turn? that's right. Sorry, a lot, lot, lot going on, his friends. Turn yeah. 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 Yep, yep, yep. All right, hold on one second. Let me just get. No, it's well, okay. It's okay. I, I, I got it. I got it. No, no, it's fine. Yeah. I got it. I just have to literally go through my head of everything that's happening. Yeah. Um. All right. So let's start with the cloud call. Uh, cloud kill. Since that is the beginning of the round, go ahead and click that, uh, please. All right, Constitution save. I don't think confusion does any negatives. It doesn't do anything to that. No All right, so uh, that will fail for 16. I am now going to go ahead and roll a 1d10 for the confusion. Yep. Thank you. And for this round, he is at a nine. He will act normally during this yeah, round. He goes normal. So we are now going to do a mud ball. Yeah, sorry guys, lot going on for everybody. Where's the mud ball? Uh, since he is, he's perp, he's gonna aim it at, yep, right here. So it's gonna hit uh, both Pikel as well as Cheezel. Mud ball. Uh, so, DC 16, please, Cheezel and Pikel. Uh, dexterity? Yes, please. Uh, Cheezel, dexterity save, please. Fail. Fail. Save the throw there, please. All right, 35 points. Do you get point. advantage as a barbarian, or is it? Oh, nice. Doesn't matter. All right, uh, that succeeds. Perfect. And then he is going to, at the end of that, try and roll a wisdom save to break out of that confusion. Um, and then what we got for uh, let me check one more thing. Okay, he's gonna make a wisdom save. Well, first he's gonna make an intelligence saving throw, and then he's gonna make a wisdom saving throw. I don't like his ult. Nice. Uh, yeah. That fails <laughs> there, and then wisdom saving. Throw. Oh, that's a charisma save. My apologies. Wisdom saving throw. He fails yeah, both harder. of them. This guy's completely body. Yeah, he, he he's currently addled right now as he's standing within the mud. <laughs> All right, Pikel. Um, okay, so I would need to get like up here to not be hit. Yeah, right? yep. okay. yeah, out of the line in front of him, directly to his east. So like here? Yeah. yeah that's fine. Okay, um, and then... Remember it's double movement in the uh, swamp. So it's 10 yeah. square. Yeah. yeah. I have 40 movement on my ward. Um, oh, cool. Eight. Uh, I'm gonna do guiding bolt, you know, all faithful. Okay. If it sometimes works, it sometimes works. <laughs> that hits. It worked. Sometimes. <laughs> I'm on it. Uh, taking Listen, okay. <laughs> taking, I'm the only uh, one that should take this. 25 pleasure, points really of a radiant. <laughs> all right. Is there anything else you'd like to do, Pikel? Um, I don't think I'm ready, Brett. Um, <laughs> Take me. <laughs> Standing back away from my monitor. <laughs> Closes his eyes. <laughs> reaches out his hand. Um, yeah, PK, let me know when you see the end of your round. End of round. All right, Cloud Kill roll, please. Huh? Cloud Kill roll, please. Oh, that's me. That's you. <laughs> that fails Die. for 31 <laughs> points of poison. Must roll a confusion to see if the execution turn even goes off. I sure hope it doesn't. <laughs> With a nine, it Oof. does. So I'm Ooh. going, so he is immediately going to slam down uh, into the mud. It will destroy um, all of this mud that is being over over here, except for the corners uh, where he wasn't standing, the, uh, the mud sphere. 
And then it's going to attack this area with the big belly cannonball. Now this is going to also destroy a section of that dome, but you will notice that anyone that is hiding, anyone behind the dome, the area of effect will stop pretty much over here. Oh my God. Yeah, Unfortunately exactly. for model, <laughs> Benji, it's going, to, con Don't it's going to continue. It's like a bee, it condenses and, into a fucking yeah. beam. And hits Benji, yeah. what's your dex plus? Concentrated uh, cannonball my dex energy. plus is plus five. Uh, okay, let's see what the saving throw this is. Uh, saving throw is going to be a 22. Damn. Oh Dex, your saving throw. Uh, wait, no, hold on. I have evasion, so I, I, any effect that makes me make a dex saving throw, I only take half damage, and if I get success, I take zero damage. But there your you plus go. for dex is only five? Yeah, it's plus five. How do I have more dex in you? Wait, what's your saving? No, what's your, what's your saving throw? My saving throw for oh, dex is plus No, your saving, saving throw is plus, plus nine, nine, model. Yeah, yeah. No, okay, sorry, sorry. model, you roll a four. I, I think that. Wait, what is it? What is the uh, save? 22. 22. Yeah, you roll. If we do 14 plus your. That's a 23. Nine. Yeah, you'll And with it. evasion, that. that means you take no damage no from the yeah, big belly okay. cannonball. Nicely well, done. What does the bull look like? The, the cannonball. Oh, I mean, he literally just slams in as if he's doing a cannonball you know, within Attack the mud. On Titan episode one. Oh, yeah. And then yeah. this giant wave of mud. Of, Bushes through, so good, uh, good, uh, good teamwork. Uh, I, you... I backflip over the mud. Yep. Yes, you do. <laughs> All right. Nice. I I have to alter something here real quick. One second. I think he's gonna come out like right over there next to the model and just eat him. Like just pick <laughs> him up, and eat him. Like, Can't backflip a mouth uh, <laughs> for less. You're you're replacing the uh, the sphere. Yes, I am because a, a, a most of it got destroyed. Beautiful. <laughs> yep, so that that half, half sphere is there. Let me just go ahead and uh, delete that. Leave that there as the sphere that is remnant there. And then for this sphere... Uh, gosh. Yeah, that was a really good use of... What, what did you use there? That was port. Important. Yeah, because I didn't roll. Nice. Yep. That, uh, That's why I gotta, that, like, cut people off. That to get it to saved work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That saved your ass. Because uh, yeah. even if you succeeded, you would have taken, like, 50 points of damage. All right. Yeah. Well, uh, I could also reaction to half that to 25. That's uh, trying. Rogues, man. Yep. Rogues. That, oh, that looks good. Uh, so, uh, you will see the mud bubble over here. As the wall itself kind of begins to crumble down, you will see him oh emerge. My God. Where is he, guys? Not yeah, you. At the at the top of the round, with condition superiority, he's going to end the synaptic. He's going to end the confusion. All right, and then he I doesn't know. All right, model. It is now your turn. Oh, action turn. By the way, goes at someone scanned action turn already. Correct. I think, so. I think I think so. Oh, actually, no one did. No, 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 no one did. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, that All was right. last time. Yeah, that so was that last was, time. Model, uh, you feel a heavy mud breathing behind you. He's got his mud pods in. He can't fucking hear. So <laughs> oh my god, probably he's gonna, right here. <laughs> he's probably gonna bonus action disengage. Okay. Probably. Okay. Um. And then, gosh, I. I need to hold my action somehow until... Hey, Skagzag, do you have anything yeah. that can light him on fire if you can't pause it to torture him? To get I have one torture? more torch in Just my so you know, he, he, uh, he is marked with uh, the guiding bolt. Yes, but does he not have a vulnerability stack? No, he does not. Okay, so I, I think I'm going to wait for that and maybe... We Just want to you, you do know that you can replace the unstable with uh, bone, correct? We but that will that will yeah, empower him if you do that. Yeah, yeah, we don't want to do that. All right, so okay. that's um, dis disengage. Then does disengage count as one of my movements, by the way, or is it just for free? As a bonus action, you disengage. That right, does but does that move movement. me? Okay, cool. Okay, five. Yeah, disengage ten, just means you can't uh, be opportunity attacked. Yep. Nope, now you're within the mud. Okay, I'm gonna. Come down here and go, Skagzag, light him up. And then I'm going to hold my action to shoot him 
with okay. vulnerability if there is a vulnerability with sneaky vulnerability okay. um, but I guess he would need to have sneak attack triggered on him um, uh, which means I would need advantage which I means Skagzag can't use the advantage for his catapult or does, does catapult that is a use? deck save not an attack roll so that does not count for advantage cool perfect he's got, right, he's got unsettling bow. words on him still for the catapult Perfect. So I'm I'm holding my bow for that advantage guiding bolt with vulnerability and sneaking vulnerability. Some big boy combos happening here. All right. Uh, does that end your round, model? That ends my round. All right. I'm Unless roll. I can. No, I bonus action. I'm good. That's my round. All right. I'm gonna roll one d two. One quad gets hit. Two model gets hit. One quad. You'll see this Let's hefty go, arm raise up and slam down where quad is at. So this is gonna be a big body slam. We're gonna add, am I adding anything or did I already calculate that? I think this all already includes the calculation. So That's 23 to hit Qua. Yeah. All right, Qua, you're gonna take 41 points of bludgeoning damage. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. I don't like that. I could have stopped this. <laughs> 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 I like I, I I like how you're like you I could have I I could have yeah I, I saw that I'm, I I'm could literally around. have swapped that roll for a seven and I was like eh, I don't even know what, eh, what are you gonna do uh Qua it is now your turn and uh Qua is going to shuffle one step this way uh and I'm going to cast Good Berry at level one oh my god beautiful so I'll yell for forty. All right. Are you eating well, just you can all only of eat them? one per action, right? Uh, there's ten berries. I don't know what to tell you. I think you only eat one good berry Up per to action. Ten berries appear in your hand. Adresh, uh, oh, you're right. Oh, you're right. It's only one berry. Yeah, out of right, combat. It's the that. best out of combat healing, but it's not. Yeah, you're right. In combat. So I could just fucking eat a handful. Of Scooby snacks. <laughs> are are you? Uh, are you still doing good berries? Yeah, cancel the move. I'll use a real healing spell. Okay. Ugh. 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 I'll use cure wounds on okay. myself. All right, at third <sighs> level. Ugh. Ha ha ha! Yeah, you you have revealed my hidden trait card. But I didn't use pickle magic. Uh, Wait, that guy looks a little bit like a pickle, though. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. Boop. Day healing. After a spell successfully heals HP, roll a 1dx. X equals the level of the spell just cast. We recover a spell slot up to that level. Hey. Wait. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 1dx, so I just cast uh, 1d3. You yep. restore up to a third level spell slot. Uh, you restore up to a second level spell slot. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, cool. Which, Thanks. What spell slot are you going to restore? Second level spell slot. Thank All you. Right. All right. You restore a second level uh, spell slot. Okie um, dokie. And then I will bonus action. Anything need to be scanned? Nope. Uh, action, uh, action, action turn. Action version. turn. I'll take the action turn. All right. On, a, on an initiative of 20. Uh, he attacks with big body slam. But now you know that goes on an initiative of 20. Cool. All right. Quad, does that end your round? Mm hmm. Gag -zag. All right. All right. Uh, we go back on the platform. Okay. Couple moves up. Right, right there. And. Is he still. Uh, like, if I hit him with fire, it won't matter. Well, that's what we want to do. Yeah, we, we want to catapult some kind of fire to give him vulnerability. Uh, okay. Just, just yeah, I'll do damage. that. I'll do a tier three. Uh, this is my last torch. torch. Right. Beautiful. Bye, torches. Is and what, you, uh, what did you say you did for his sword. dex? Like, or his dodge? A dex dodge? He's good. He'll be minus 1d10. Okay. All right. So you're using unsettling words on this, or are you waiting yes. until I roll? Okay. So I'm going to roll the dex save, which is going to be an 8. We're going to roll 1d10, which Surprise. is 8. He has a 0 <laughs> okay. on that, which means this will go off. doesn't up. even move. He watches. Perfect. Yeah. Uh, that hits for 19 points of damage. She gains a vulnerability stack. Did I get a... Can I re-roll the one and the two? Uh, yes, you can. Roll, uh... Roll, uh... You said there was a D8? one and two in there? Yep, yeah, roll a uh, 2d6, please. We'll subtract three from the amount. Uh oh that that's a 26. Yep. Oh, look at that damage! <laughs> <laughs> 
Hey, uh, five, 11, roll. three, uh, eight points, eight more points of damage. Roll a d20, please. Aye, aye. 14. Hey, hey, guess what just happened? What? A big meaty fog cloud surrounds, <laughs> which then turns into a pile oh, of God, mud. Did hit model. All right, just leave Skaxag in the fog. Skaxag's gonna stuff. die. He just <laughs> entombed himself. He's gone. It's, he's dead. He'll suffocate. I look <laughs> over my shoulder and I'm like, Skag? <laughs> and then I'm gonna fire off the... Uh... Oh. <laughs> Skag <laughs> fires. He's his way out. It's, it's okay. He served his purpose. Uh, are you he spending a vulnerability stack? Live by the fog, I'm gonna do sneaky by the vulnerability. Fog. All right. Oh, you're using sneak. Well, so sneaky vulnerability uh, means you can use a sneak attack. If you haven't used a sneak attack this round, you don't have to use sneaky vulnerability. You can just use it as a vulnerability. Wait, to use it again this round? Wait, so why would I ever use it? Did you use? Because I only get one attack per round. Yeah. Did you use sneak attack? Well, sometimes you get uh, multiple attacks per round if you have two daggers, for example. Oh, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's or, definitely... In case you ever wanted to melee that thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Or, thing. or uh, attacks of opportunity. Yeah, lots of things. I see, I see, I see. Sorry, yeah, so... my bad. I misunderstood. No, you're I thought good. it was just applying a second one on, uh, on no, my no, no, vulnerability no, no. stack. No, okay. it allows well, you to use... I'm going to do my regular bow shot. Okay, are you using a vulnerability stack? Yes. Okay. I believe that was my condition for even yep. doing it in the first place. 30 hits with sneak attack. You deal 13, 18... 18 plus 24, 40. You deal 80 points of damage. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. As you literally see the arrow shoot through uh, a Chief Big Belly's eye. Oh, yeah. Huh. That's good. That's fucked. All right. Does that end your round? Um, Gag Zag is now currently stuck in a, in a double mud. <laughs> <laughs> That's my... Uh, Sorry, did we get the concentration term? Yes, you did. That goes yes, on initiative sorry, my bad. 10. My bad, I missed Oh, it. you're good. Okay, yeah, that's, uh, I will bonus action hide. Skag Zag will suffocate in two minutes. Okay, wait, can I bonus Great. action? Can you, can you do anything to break through this with a bonus action? Uh, he can use oh, no, his action to dig Sorry. through. That was yeah. a held action. Uh, this All isn't right. my turn. All right, Skag Zag, uh, you used an action. You're currently entombed in mud. And so that's it. You're done. Clerk. <laughs> All, right. All right. Awesome. How could this happen to me? Clerk's going to move out of the way of this guy. Oh, sorry. I wasn't uh, This guy's horrible nightmare. Uh -huh. Okay. God, I really want to let Cheezel finish this guy off, but I don't think he's going to make the gap. I can't move there in time. Yeah, I don't think you'll make it. But I could stall him by just confusing him for a round they'll probably go over to you but i don't know if i want to risk it because skagzag can't dodge an attack i if anything i'll just break him out this turn i'll break skagzag out with the uh, power of my axe to himself <laughs> <laughs> let him yeah. die clarence just gonna <laughs> clarence gonna unsettling words the guy actually no fuck actually yeah i'll unsettling words the guy all right he's unsettled and since I need something that does a constitution, like my bardic thing, I will just cast a shatter at uh, sixth level of him. That's 30 live. points of damage. If I didn't fucking fury the small him. <laughs> that is, with a 25, he will succeed. Wait, well, what I am I? I? I unsettling words to him. Wait, hold on. Is that... Wait, eight plus? Oh, yeah, because he's got to get saved through. Yeah. Oh, okay, so 25, 19, unsettling words, 1d10. And here we go with 421. Man, I hate this freaking guy. Like, whatever. Man. All right, that's 15 what the fuck minus ever, 12 points of damage. All right. Anything else you'd like to do, Clerk? Chisel, throw something at him. Just Jeez. like huck something at him. Chisel. You know what? Is it possible to throw my axe at his head? At disadvantage, yes. Let me look through my character and see if there's anything. Oh, wait, I'm hold on. Someone said I rolled a d20. I need to roll a d10, so that four does not count. Still a four. All right. We did it legit. <laughs> Continue. All right, I want to Jeezel. do it. Okay. I'm looking through my things really quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Do it. Uh, 
All right, Brett. Yes. Can I? Oh boy. Can I? When I look at my feet, okay, so I can't use rage. So, all right, I would like to use reckless attack hmm? to make it so giving advantage on a melee attack roll using strength during this turn. Yep, you can roll normally. This will not be an advantage. You can reckless attack Great. as you throw your axe. I would like to throw my axe at his big, dumb, stupid head. All right. You lift your axe back and you throw. With a 25, oh! the axe goes flying and deals with 11 points of damage. The axe just and suddenly as you see as you see the axe hit Chief Big Belly's head, his eyes roll back. And with no more unstable charges, unceremoniously, he falls into the mud. Oh, what's happening? Where did that come from? <laughs> Hello? End Guys, of we need to get Skagzag out. End of initiative. Hey. Can I use shape um, water to just open a door in the mud? <laughs> uh, you're gonna do a lot more than that, but you spend uh, you spend some time uh, digging through the mud, and eventually you you are able to free Skagzag if that is what you are doing. Uh, oh up, Jesus! <laughs> Who's that? Uh, I don't know. It's the word I made up. Oh, makes sense. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> nice shot, Chisel, with the axe. Thank you. <laughs> Wait, where the hell's your axe, though? <laughs> Start going oh, yeah. the wild look at Claire, go get the axe. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Claire falls inside the giant world. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, hold on, that's a, that's, that's a, I like this color better. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. He, missed, yeah, he falls back in. <laughs> yeah, so, um, as, uh, he, it, as he lands down, a giant whirlpool forms within there where you see kind of like the axe circling around and being swallowed by the whirlpool. Um, Clurnt, as you walk it, are you walking, do you walk towards the whirlpool I'm as it forms? Was the whirlpool there or did it open as he was walking towards it? Because if you, he was walking towards it and it opened, he fell into it a hundred percent. Absolutely. Uh, In that case, you all see Clurnt immediately yeah, circle around the whirlpool. Yeah. And, uh, he, no. he, he gets swallowed, he gets immediately swallowed within the whirlpool. Don't fight it, Clunt. You have to swim into it. Follow the current. Clunt? <laughs> Is he gone? Uh, yep, um, he's gone. <laughs> okay. Uh, Was that supposed to happen? I don't bloody know. Clunt went after X. He finds Steven. Yeah. What? <laughs> Steven, oh. my... Who Steven? Is Steven? <laughs> Axe of the Fungazoid plus three. <laughs> plus three, that's weird. Anyway, <laughs> looks like the uh looks like the entrance is closed up, guys. It might actually be on the only way out. Uh jeez. More geez. portals. What if we leave Hugabi, Chief? It's not Every a time... it's, it's, it's not a portal, it's like a whirlpool within the uh within the mud. That's Shifting, a portal. Oh, hey, whatever you'd like to do, I just want to make sure that you know exactly what you're seeing. <laughs> Guys, I think we, we might need to, to go, go in there to get out. We have to go after him, right? Well, I mean, we have to save him, obviously, if it's fucked up, but, like, that might be our only option, you know? Just checking our other options with the door. We so, can live in the mud. Have a great time. Yes, who go in first? Pickle, why don't you get some mud here? Bye, Qua! In your jar. Goodbye, Quad. Quad. I just, I just, I do. You know how scuba divers like just flip slowly the fall in the boat. Yeah. I kind of just flip back on my back and just let it like. You just nonchalantly drop backwards. Moto, you want me to betray Brian? I thought your Brian was empty. That doesn't mean I need to betray. No, it's just temporary. You're gonna hold it and then empty it on the other side, just in case we have none, right? Okay, I guess. Oh. <laughs> He's gonna shovel yeah, some mud. He tugs at his collar. 
<laughs> She'll put some mud in her jar. All right, let's go after clone. Okay. You ready, Cheezel? Skag? Uh, I guess. Cheezel looks at the throne just like, put that the door oh! I can't even just sit in the throne for like 20 seconds. All right, go on then. Go on, Cheezel. <laughs> <laughs> it's me, Cheezel, the big boy's chief man. Come on, guys, clap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's very cool. The coolest You're thing really I've ever cool. seen. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, Pika. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'd step into the pool. <laughs> oh, I guess the sand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll follow. All right. Um, so uh, we are almost done with the day session. If you guys don't mind going over a little bit, I do not mind. Animal Crossing 2.0 is out, Brett. Oh, he okay. said it. He fucking said it. Yeah. I, I'm just saying, but I'm willing to, you know. Of course, this is D&D, because D&D is great. Thank yeah, we you. are here. We are present. That's pretty great. Thank you. Thank I'm you. present. I definitely am not playing Animal Crossing 2.0 as we roll. Fucker, I'm, I'm waiting. Not, yeah. I'm D &D actually not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. That's what I said. I'm definitely not. <laughs> you are. Fuck off. I can All hear right. it in the background. No, you, you can't. As you uh, all dive into the whirlpool, you will all reemerge. Or reemerge. Reemerge? Re That's the word. Right? That sounds about right. Yeah, reemerge. Uh, on the other side of IO. Bum, bum, bum. 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 That's bum. fucking sick. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Now, Laudine. <laughs> well, reemerge as humans. Bump, bump. Like, I can do this all day. What do you, what do you got? <laughs> well, that would be terrible for Skagzag's psyche. Oh, right? That, that, that would be fucked. <laughs> that would, it still would be the most fucked up thing that we did today. That oh, yeah. Was. Yeah, I'm no, still, that was fucked I'm up. I'm still reeling did. from. Clark's covered in guts. We I'm made, yeah. we made a daughter watch her father die. From the inside. We made her <laughs> kill her father. <laughs> we made her eat her. The last like, thing she saw was then, him eating her. But then <laughs> we killed her in front of him as mud. Yes. Anything is the best of both worlds. So like, oh, yeah. we really yeah. did everything possible to be awful today. As Every you yeah. as you uh, remerge. Oh that oh that that works. A nice little transition. Yes. Um. You know. You obviously, at this point, you see nothing as you get swallowed up. You hear the familiar sounds of the swamp. As you feel things shifting around you. Sticks? Rocks? Dicks? dicks. I, I said sticks. Dicks. Sticks. Dicks. I heard dicks. I heard dicks, dicks right there, too. I heard dicks. <laughs> I heard dicks. Dicks? Yeah. dicks? dicks? Rocks? You let, let me know when you're done. <laughs> we're done, we're done, we're done. Yeah, 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 yeah. He okay. said dick. Okay. <laughs> you feel around to sticks. He's feeling. All right. Just waiting. I'm waiting. Oh I'm waiting. <laughs> it's like fifth grade all over again. Yeah. yeah. Except all... you can be seven muted. Uh, so. <laughs> or and no detention. So pretty good. Okay. Anyways, uh, all right, we're just going to jump right into it then. Uh, you feel around to what are um, apparently like bones, essentially, that you begin uh -oh. to, to feel around. You see chunks of viscera. Of uh, You kind of feel like corpses and bodies as your eyes are just covered by the swamps. And as you look up and awaken, the sunlight peering through the jungle familiar face on a stump one you've seen before you got to kidding me oh my no. god not oh again my god. not again you can't Are you escape kidding the sky me? <sighs> i don't know i kind of liked him last time <laughs> god damn it dude he would look down upon the stump staring down over at you yeah Are you dead? Let me kill you. How the hell are you here? Are we dead? Yeah. yeah, is this like a figment of our imagination? Didn't we fall through the ground? Why are there trees? 
So Where we? is that a stick and or rock? <laughs> Didn't we see this place in the yeah, uh, in the dream yes, the dream land. Land. yeah. So um the whirlpool pulled you through the underground in sort of like a like an underground like swamp river. And as you mm. lifted back up, you emerged within the swamp. Uh Randall oh. will look down. And he said, um, say, yes, I did die once. I believe you were the ones that killed me. Pikal's going to cover up her fucking armor. <laughs> uh, I mean, look, you came at us first. You started it. He yeah, you started it. He, uh, he shakes his head. By the way, uh, he is not wearing the oblim, uh, the armor, but he's wearing like an old like linen mm. robe. Right. He, and he just okay. sort of looks down over at you and he says, mm, You all seem very familiar. Um, unfortunately, that must have been a, a previous life. I've learned quite a bit since I've been here in my time. Are we dead? He, so what do you mean previous life? He uh, shakes his head. He looks over to you. You all actually have the chance to be reborn. He stares. I know it. We're dead. He we stares. died. Yeah. He'll he'll, uh, oh, no. he'll stare over to you, and uh, as he does so, he'll see the cracks. Yeah, he'll see the cracks that are deep in your face. He'll see your your body sort of like deteriorating and fall apart and he'll just state you're not dead not yet at least this area right here is the the source the source of all of us where we all came back where Even we all me. reborn <laughs> Back of the room. Ignore Qua. He'll look over <laughs> at and in the corner of the dunce cap. <laughs> <laughs> but he'll stare down over to you. Now why did you come here? What was your purpose? Well, we're, we're dying. We need to we need yeah, to stop crumbling. this. But we can get the person you did it to us. And you've come to the right place. Are you, any of you, with Chief Big Billy? Uh, oh, we well, we were <laughs> just a couple of weeks ago with him. Right, right. Uh, is yeah. that going to be a problem? He kind of like scoffs at that, and he'll just say, "My allegiance is to 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 life, to the mud. I don't care who sits at the throne." Yeah. Well, All right. we returned yeah, him to good. the mud, and uh, Cheezel over here sits at the throne, so... Pikel, are you going to be cool today? Because, <laughs> like, this is kind of important, and I see you shaking. <laughs> She's, like, turning red <laughs> <laughs> from just, holding her breath. <laughs> just, uh, just rein it in for now, okay? Just do it good. Look, we just need to we need to fix whatever this is so we can get on our way. Honestly, Chief Big Belly was just unfortunately in the way uh, to that. Didn't really give us much of a choice. Well, this right here is the location to do it. You simply need to submerge yourselves within the mud and remember will awaken full of vitality. Right. This isn't going to, like, do anything to our heads. I'm not going to, like, wake up not remembering what I did. Or our bodies, though. Yeah, like, our physical form, we're going to look the same. He nods as he'll, uh, yeah, as he'll state, um, this will simply revitalize you. Uh, uh, okay! She's uh, away. She's doing it. You Damn just it. see... She's just, she's just fall into the mud as he'll submerge yeah, just in. like plop, plop. Uh, one sec. Everyone but Cheezle, huddle. I think we wait to see what happens to Cheezle. 
Yeah, honestly, he's taken honestly, the dice. He just took the, he just took he, the huge fall. He's completed his entire arc. He yes. is good. He, the death flags were raised. My we're arc's good. not done. All right, you know, like, I'm not I done with my arc. We did Bard College, arc. okay, class? No, 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 that wasn't my arc. I got that arc hijacked by a bunch of fucking college I students. I want an arc. We haven't started your arc, Qua, okay? You've only been here for a few episodes. Well, I don't know how to tell you this, but it's the end of the damn series coming up. I don't know there's going to be time for your arc. I man. need uh, my sorry, main arc. So what about me? I don't like mine. Google, you did a thing. You, you, you put because your arc the is mud. about acceptance or something, blah, 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 yeah. blah, 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 you know? Except wow. Yeah. I, it's going to throw up. Acceptance uh, and understanding that, you know, life sucks. Yeah. And you know, your and your arc was it. not flipping out just now. You did yeah, it. You, that was your arc. That was it. Well done. Anyway. Skag -Zag, I don't <laughs> even know. I think Skag Zag's arc was the concussion. Skag Zag's arc is like, it's uh. not like a, it's not like an arc. It's more like straight lines that form lots of weird square shapes. And My stuff. arc was, I wanted to make a circus and we made, we kind of made a circus. We lived that life. Wait. So moral of the story, get in the mud. Wait. Hold on. You're not crumbling. <laughs> I don't Jesus? think you. I don't think you should get in the mud, Qua. If I'm gonna be honest, I think that would. Oh. I don't even know what that would do to you. I would never. What do I see, bro? You know, I'll just let you do whatever you want to do with Qua. Where the hell? Where the hell? Where's Cheezel? Cheezel is gone. Uh, um, I'm gonna look up at the paladin. Um, mm -hmm. where did Cheezel go? He is being reborn in the swamp. He's, uh, right. where's he come out though? And is he, uh, when's he done cooking? He just kind of motions around the trunk at this point. How long does this, uh, take then? Sometimes it takes minutes, sometimes days, weeks, months. That's a, lo oh. a lot of uncertainty there. Sounds actually. like, uh, he nods. Um... It takes as long as it needs to. Right. Based on how like epic the person being reborn is, I imagine. Don't when... worry, I'll wait here for you to come out. Thanks, Qua. Thanks, Qua. He's so really nice, nice, honestly. I'll he doesn't need sure an arc. He's already nice. Not up to anything. <laughs> Thank you, Qua. Thank you, Qua. Let's. Uh... And and you sure that when we come out, we're gonna remember everything? No. Uh... He he nods. You'll remember everything. You'll be just the way uh, you are. Well, Jesus already in, and it might take to too long. insight this guy. I don't know. I'm getting a weird vibe here. I don't know. I want to find he out if this guy's is, like being deceptive at all. He is not being deceptive. He is being devout. Yeah, okay. I mean, for a religious seller, that's to be expected. He yeah. believes the source, yeah. but yeah. we don't know if the source. He is also good worked as an assassin, which us. is why I don't trust him. <laughs> yeah. I mean, but, but he's being honest, at least to what he thinks it will yeah. do. We just don't know if what he thinks uh, Wait. is good for us. About my payment. Huh? What? <laughs> the money we agreed upon. Well, we never oh, agreed yeah. on any no, money no, for you. No, we totally did. <laughs> what? But did we? Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. We pay you when we are reborn. That's what I was going to say, right? That's a good idea. Qua? All I right. just need a small loan of a thousand Model, gold. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't honestly know why Qua still st even still with us, to be honest. I don't I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. He's nice, though, and he heals us. He's nice. I like that. That's um, Qua, if we plant, mm. like, ten gold, eventually it will be reborn as a thousand gold. So mm. why don't we just take the money with us, and then we'll come back and give you the gold. More gold. How about you give me a thousand gold or I leave? <laughs> Where to, Qua? Where to? <laughs> I never told you for a negotiator, Qua. You, you drive a hard bargain. Fuck, how much gold do we have, Clint? You Check guys uh, out of character have like thousands upon thousands of gold. <laughs> you don't spend it on anything. Yeah, well, you might eventually. We're, we might be going to a large you magister, magister later. We might have to spend it right now, too. All right, I'm gonna be above the board with you. You're probably not coming out for like thousands of years. Yeah, I know, and that's why we need all that money. No, We're not gonna I have need... any fucking yes, safety net. No, 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 no. You I know what? Need... The money's gonna be worth in a thousand I years, Greg. I need a thousand gold so that I can turn a tree into a tree person. Oh, Qua, look, I commanded think... to watch over this place. <laughs> oh, and you could have said that, Qua. Oh, 
<laughs> well, why do you need a thousand gold? What the fuck are you gonna do? <laughs> Some of my higher level magics require <laughs> material wealth that I this lack. That this doesn't guy. seem like a scam. That seems really honest. Insight check. Oh, I'd like to insight check him. What do you What do you want from me? I'm not. I want to know if you're you. trying to scam us. I'm not. <laughs> you can detect no deception. Look, let's hey, figure this out in, in one right second. There. All right, in one second. <laughs> hey, gang, are we doing this or not? I, yeah, uh, I think we have to. We yeah. have to. Pickle, Skag. I'm gonna quickly commune with my god. <laughs> it's time. Now, it's now or never. You have really. a god? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> we don't know if it's real though. We have no idea. Oh. I get three yes or no questions. <laughs> oh, just to the void. You just toss that yeah. out there. <laughs> Hello, it's Pickle God. If you're listening, I need to know some things. If I get the reborn from the mud, am I betraying you? You Please hear... Please send back. Nothing. Oh, he's terrible! He's not reply to me! Well, I mean, because you are, like, in the worst place to get... I don't know. Reception. Yeah. Reception, oh, Wi Fi. That's a concept signal. that I understand. Oh, Pickle God, if you're gonna hear me, please tell me yes or no. Can you hear me? You hear nothing. Pickle. Oh, yeah. you, did, did you hear anything? Uh, <laughs> There's no reply. How about no reply. Just... How about you just pick a nice patch of mud over here, Clint starts well, Hold on, Clint, hold on. <laughs> Clint, that's not how you handle this, mate. Clint. It's a god, it's like a whole thing. That's her art. Just, listen, Pickle, you asked if they, yes. if your god could hear you, right? And they couldn't, because they didn't respond. They would have said no otherwise, because they Which wouldn't been care about you. Yeah, no, wait, no, they would have answered. How would they ever be able to answer the question at all? Because that's, you wouldn't that's, know what, what the question was. If, I assume that's what their relationship is. If they can hear, they would answer, right? Well, I mean, it's just like their question is kind of like a nothing question because if they could hear it, they would answer it. If right, they couldn't, don't criticize it now. Oh a nothing question? <laughs> Where are Pickle, we listen, anyway? They definitely oh, can't hear no. you. They definitely care about you. They're real. Yeah. And oh, they will come and save you no matter what. Okay? What is this true? Right. believe that. The root of all are you sure? Just I'm, like I'm so sure. <laughs> I'm so 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 sure. Brett, can I roll deception? Oh yeah, absolutely. God. Can I can I help him? Can I give <laughs> him an advantage? Like, I'm gonna be nodding it. I'm just be nodding along with my. Oh, yeah, it's really. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Life absolutely. is a lie. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's like, you just see him gritting through his teeth. Okay. Yeah, it's not, so. it's not looking Pico good. It's like a kid just that just got their ice cream smacked out of their hand. <laughs> you just found out that Santa's not real. not real. Yeah, I just found out Santa's not guy's, real. You're deity. Yeah, Look, you know, you're, Pico, genius, whatever. you're not gonna get. You, they, there's no way you can be able to talk to them. You know what? Here. He's okay. I can be reborn. Life doesn't matter anymore. Oh, I mean, man, how works. about look at this? How about look at this mud over here, Pico? <laughs> It's actually pretty good, but I'm with you now, Clan. It didn't <laughs> work. Look at this mud over here. Oh, this is like a nice spot. I am looking. Show me. It's okay, like pickle. Right, if you right if you went in the mud, it's kind of like you're pickling yourself, you know? Okay, I'm listening. Keep going. Mud is the brine. You are the pickle, right? You okay? I listen. <laughs> right here, the mud. You see, yeah, that one right there. Yeah. Uh huh. Go on. You'll be I, fine. I'm gonna get into the mud. I hope she's gonna you be fine. You say I'm going to be fine, okay? I trust yeah. you, Waffle. You trust me, that's a good decision. Oh, it's just me doing some math. Don't look at me. Meanwhile, you see, you see, you see Clerk right now move his hands around. <laughs> And he's just like, don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh I'm like distracting God. her and you're like doing this. He's, he's cursing. He's cursing under his breath shit. right now. Oh yeah. Damn it. I am going to be a pickle and when I come out, I will be beautiful. The like best pickle ever. Thanks, Mato. Good night. 
Good night, Kiko. I'm sure you're feeling at least a little bit drowsy. And you all. <laughs> oh my God. As <laughs> my money, wait. Where's my money? Oh, as you I got my money right as, now. Clerk jumps into the mud. As you then drown, uh, Pekel. And <laughs> she's drowned. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> I'm Skag. gone. Oh, fuck. Skag. You ready? Gonna go in the mud? Wait. Where's the mud at? On the floor, mate. As, as you're as standing a, in it. As, yeah, as you're oh. up to your knees. The dementia RP is over. You are I'm gonna... <laughs> Do you want me to help Technology you out, buddy? Is crazy. You need a hand, Skag? Uh, hold on. I'm gonna start jumping up and down. <laughs> He's just jumping up in the mud. Slowly, slowly sinking as he does so. I'm gonna put my arms on his shoulders and just like, uh, <laughs> and, <laughs> and then you like, drown, as, as you then drown an old man in the mud. <laughs> anyway, all right, well, they weren't too on board with this, but I'm gonna help you out. Well, I'm literally I'm gonna... just stood there with one hand outstretched, like <laughs> waiting for something, and I've been standing there for like a couple of minutes, just like. I'm gonna take, oh, go on. No, I'm just standing there waiting for something to be put in my hand, and it better be a thousand plus gold. All right, it's fine. I'm I'm gonna hit you up, right? Because you've done good by us, clan. Mo's gonna reach in his pocket, take out a my various assortment Qua. of things. Yeah, Qua. <laughs> buttons, maybe about oh like God. fifty gold coins. The clan he can't is count. the mushroom on my head, so he's gonna put it. Up. He's gonna put it in your hand. Walk away, turn around, do finger Wait, guns much? like I got Wait, you, bud, did you put and then hand? dive into the mud. Thirty gold. Thirty? <laughs> <laughs> like yes, up, dude. It's not close enough. It's not that easy oh out here. My As I sink, I got you. Two thumbs up for the last thing you see. I'm literally <laughs> oh, opening your little baggie to see how many. <laughs> One. The goblin paladin Ooh. shakes his head. That's fucked up, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think this is enough. I don't think hey, it you is forgot. Either. Oh. <laughs> As you all oh. swoon. <laughs> <laughs> As you That's all su submerge into the mud, you begin to feel yourself slumber as if you uh, are falling asleep. You've been feeling like achy and ill and, and sick for. Uh, going on almost weeks now as you've been constantly in a state of pain. It's my daily life. As you've been constantly in a state of pain wandering through the Ishtar Highlands. Oh, wait, this is D&D. &D. As you've been wondering, yeah, as you can, sorry, I doubt there's a, as you continue <laughs> you get to wonder, the joke, the real life pain. No, no, I got it. I just got it. Oh, okay, yeah. I'm trying to yeah. say something, yeah. Um, That's fun, sorry. Uh, as you continue to wander through the Ishtar Highlands in complete yeah, pain, your body falling apart and fail, you know, failing upon you. And as you sleep and slumber, you begin to dream. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. You begin to dream of another time, of another life. as you awaken from this dream. You stare down into your human Oh my god. Hands. I'm gonna throw up. Oh my god. Oh. I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna hurl everything. Oh my god, look at the drawing. I'm, I'm looking at the this I'm gonna look is beautiful. <laughs> Wait, that's so cute. I never realized it's, how similar Skagzag and Clarence are. Skagzag looks so actually so terrifying, though. That's, that's <laughs> this terrific. is the village. This is the haunted village. Yeah, we it was us. Yeah. Oh my mm -hmm. goodness. Uh, <laughs> and you awaken to live uh, a memory of a previous life before you became your goblin self. Whoa. Wait, we and woke up in the past? Yeah. Mm hmm And that Whoa. will end today's session. Oh my god. Of Goblins of Io. <laughs>
Pikel looks Hell so yeah. fucking cute as a human. Ah, no. <laughs> that's not the one we The worst <laughs> thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Pikel's so awesome. And then. Uh, is one of Yeah, yeah it's, so good. it's Bird. Uh, there's Sheezel. Fantastic. There's Sheezel. Uh, here's a uh, m uh, model. Roguish <laughs> <Okay>. mo <laughs> model. So wonderful. Uh, Pikel. Oh, look at that. It's so cute. Little pickle eyes. Yeah. Those are pickle eyes. He and and storekeeper Clint. <laughs> it's my cool. hair. <laughs> <laughs> Muscle is literally Clint with dude. a massive mane of hair. It's just coincidental. Muscle bald. is literally bald, dude. And now we've got five of that. <laughs> Why not Clint? This is bullshit. So I demand revision. <laughs> <laughs> um. So yeah, we're gonna learn a little bit about Damn. why you became what you became uh, in the next session of Goblins of Io. Um, wow. So some things, Whoa. so some things to think about, like what your human name would have been. Oh and, my god! And potentially what you would have been doing in the day-to-day -day human life. I hate God. We get a session of me hanging out with the paladin, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what if Qua yeah. just walks in though? You got like time to kill. <laughs> Yo, Qua's like thousands upon thousands of years old. He just walks into town. Hello. <laughs> in the past. Uh, no for asking us young. <laughs> I young fucking fast yeah. talking Qua. Uh, so, um, yeah, and then for uh, Gmart, if you'd like to like role play like a, like a human NPC. No, nah, I like just that. won't be there. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Hi, Qua. Uh, Hi, Qua, well, dude. It was well, lovely having you. Stingy bastard. Happy 30 gold. Dude, <laughs> next time you want a thousand. thousand gold, how about you <laughs> slay like a world ending threat with us, I all right? Loaded a king with Big Deli. So, uh, it so, wasn't a lot of money. <laughs> so, next next, uh, next session, uh, it looks like Gmart will be, be setting out, but potentially session after that, depending on what's going on. Uh, but, uh, but, yeah, that's what planned for oh. our next session with the uh, humans of io i suppose yeah. damn can i say one final thing brett real quick please, please please um in my pocket among the buttons and the 30 odd gold pieces there was also a tiny baggie of void meth that's that um that summer gave me yes and that is in quas possession now i guess presumably because that's in the same pocket i won't Ex notice or remember it's it's not gonna be good if you don't. I don't know what void meth means, but I mean, I'm not gonna eat it. So what's it gonna do? Like burn a hole in my pocket? Uh, like... <laughs> how'd you guys like day session? How do you like the? Uh... Great. I yeah. loved Funny. blowing up. Okay. That was so yeah, that fucked was up. So fucked that up. was actually super. I felt actually bad like doing that. Like we once peaked. I, I thought about we it. Peaked. Walking into the session, I was like, "We're gonna take the princess and we're gonna use her as a hostage." Is that what you thought? Yeah, I thought that too. Honestly, I was like, we're gonna use it to negotiate with the king. Sorry, dude. This was Cheezle's arc. And then immediately you're like, what if we fed her to him? And I all I can think is like, it's her fucking birthday, and like it was her birthday. What a birthday surprise, though. She was definitely surprised. We we got that. That's so fun. Um, we've got a little bit of fan art. Did you guys like the uh, the end reveal, the ending reveal? Yeah, hell yeah. I love, I love the new art. Yeah, Those are all such so good designs. Nice. Especially I the, Honestly, I've loved this whole arc, like this <laughs> yeah. whole story. Like, I thought I thought it's been great. Oh, good. Yeah. I can't yeah. wait to find out what all of your voices are like. I know. Because... I was just thinking, Pikel would be able to actually speak. Probably. Like, what yeah. your human voices? Oh, yeah, oh, think about it. Wait, like, are we, we human Oh, yeah. Are we tall? What? <laughs> Are you what? Yeah, repeat human. the question. Repeat the oh, question. Sorry, I was like, what size are we? Are we just normal size? You're human. Humans? You're human, human size. Yeah. Wow. Damn. Yeah. Damn. I already know what Clarence's name would be. I'm like a nice little tween. I'm do you so want to right, reveal right? it now or do you want to wait for next it's, session? It would definitely just be Clint or something. Clint. Clint yeah. yeah. Clint. I feel like it should be adjacent stuff. Yeah. Do, you got, do you guys have an idea of what your uh, human names would be, or are you going to need time to think about that? Models you cut out, like Matthew or something. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I said, uh, do you guys have ideas of your human names, or are you going to need the week to think about it? By the way, I, I made uh, made sure that uh, Skagzag was literally an old man. <laughs> Just this old... Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> he looks, Disgusting. like, still terrifying. Probably yeah. more terrifying. Yeah. Yeah, he's like he's the, the age that you guys gave me is the age that you are currently in. Uh so, you know, uh you know, Pikel is the age that uh Bree gave me. Everyone that the, oh, the nice. question yeah, the question I asked like what what is your age? That is currently your uh your age. 
Nice. So the human Love equivalent it. of the goblin ears. Yeah, it's yeah. just like translated. Oh, that's cool. Gotcha. Very cool. Well, I'm gonna hold on to names and stuff to next session. Yeah, please, please do. Uh, yeah, uh, I need to think up with me. Yeah, and also think, yeah, and kind of think of like, you know, if your character was a human, what would your day to day be like? You know, like what, what, yeah, what is all that? <laughs> Makes so. bottles. Admittedly, Crendor, you can still be named Skagzag, <laughs> and just look at your character, no one would question it. Yeah. yeah. I hate goblins. I hate goblins. I hate the goblins. What can I say? I just hate them. We got some, <laughs> let's do some, uh, let's do some and fan I hate art. Be, I hate to be reborn as one, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh boy sorry let me let me share the screen real quick all right a wave of tiredness just hit me i'm like oh boy uh well, anyways yeah uh this is a model done Yo. In, uh, model oh, i love that this was done in Yo. ms paint by the way Oh, Damn. this is the MS Paint uh, auto yeah, 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 this is Nam. So yeah. Wow. Yeah, well, yeah. Ender, couldn't you make that? Yeah, yeah why uh, can't you make like that? By by the way, uh, <laughs> the Lawful of Mike did this, this Pikel, and I absolutely love it. Uh, <laughs> oh, my gosh. oh, that's oh, you that's know so that art. Fun. You know that art. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You see in the why corner of so your tall? kitchen at midnight. <laughs> Yep, yep. Oh, Crawling on the walls. Oh, is that her God. tongue or a pickle? I can't it's a pickle. Tell. It's, a pickle. it's a pickle. I hope. I don't know. <laughs> no, it said in the description. Tongue the I love green. that. That's my favorite pickle so far. It's so good. Uh, let me, let me Yes, accurate. Save this up and then uh, sync this because we got a... Uh, Bird also did a lovely uh, animation. Uh, animation? Hell yeah. Mm -hmm, uh, last, uh, last session, which is really good. So let me... Uh, I'm gonna upload this. We shouldn't need to sync it if we're watching your live stream. Right? Yeah, but but you need the sound. There's sound. We can. Uh, can we not hear? Oh that? wait, can you hear? Can you hear from? I don't know. Sound some can sometimes be. I a think we weird. can. So well, it depends because like I'm doing a display. Yeah, and I can. Also, uh, I can see. I can hear your World of Aya tab sound. Yes, but that's because oh, yeah. that's because we're still on the same tab as the World of Io tab. Oh okay. So yeah, this will this would be like a separate like video file. So okay. Um, Download. Yeah, give me one second. <clears throat> or you can actually just play play it through there. Uh, or yeah, yeah, play it straight through Discord. Yeah. Yeah. I'm oh, ready I when guess you guys I, are. I, I guess I could do that. I'll just goblins gonna I'll run over share that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Eh, crap. Holding. Holding. Continue to hold. Holding. Holding for animation. Take your time, Brett. Holding. <laughs> I'm changing. How long are you guys going to be in that mud? Am I going to be like the dog from Futurama? <laughs> yeah. You're going to so be the sad. dog from Futurama. <laughs> no. Turtles don't dog live that long. Dog from Futurama. No. Turtles don't I've live. I've been no, Futurama. Not ungodly long. Just like I feel like you're going to turn into just a sea of mushrooms. I'm just like going to be a, I'm just going to grow into you. a tree. And I'm just yeah. going to sit there and die. <laughs> I like that. I don't I mean, like that. Sorry. I mean, maybe. <laughs> Mile. Uh, all you didn't right. give me a thousand gold, you know, it's whatever. Okay. Still wait for his gold that'll never come. You got meth. Uh, uh, that meth right. is worth a thousand. <laughs> all, right, yeah, I'm, I'm, all right, I'm playing it now. <laughs> this goblin's gonna run over and pulling out a shank, gonna do a stabby stab over at. You sure Pico. about that? <laughs> <laughs> you really wanna get in melee range and peek him? <laughs> that's all that goblin does. Matt, I'm gonna move into range. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, <laughs> rush on over and start stabbing. Oh, I love this. So, oh my god. Oh. He still stands. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow. Wow. How do you think that? What is up with you? I am dying. I am not on my A game. You lame. You lame. You really backed you up on this one. Bonus action. Spit on his face. Bonus action, reaction, Wait, spits on your face. The <laughs> the oh my God. Run over. So Holy good. Shit. That was so good. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, I love that. And then uh, look at this lovely. Oh, I love that. That's sweet. That's good head like reflections. The light, <laughs> the armor too. It's really good. Uh, really good. Yo, that was done really freaking quickly. What the heck? Yeah, holy We're shit. Dude, it looks like Model's brain is visible. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's not very big like brain. No, brain. No, he's he's very like, big brain. In the it's brain. It's pre-evolved. <laughs> We've got a uh, Smurf sag <laughs> over here. Smurf oh sag. Oh my god! Oh my I'm god! Now. <laughs> oh, wow. So uh, and, uh, sorrowful. 
Dire, wow, di- yeah, that's really good. Oh my god, that's good. amazing. Mm-hmm. Dire, of course, uh, I believe does some excellent skag zag as we see here. <laughs> <laughs> How could this happen oh to god. me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh, sorry. And here's the uh, the new version of that. My apologies. Oh, well, obviously, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. That. I was gonna say. <laughs> thank you. Thank that. you so much. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Uh, yo, we got, uh, yeah, uh, Ishtar Swamp's fan music. Hello? Oh, shit. Hello? We have our own Ishtar theme? Yeah, hold up, hold up. I got it on mute. Hold up. DMCA. I <laughs> <laughs> got him. Can you guys hear Daddy. this? Can you guys hear this? Yeah. yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's, that's actually that really good. That was also good. an MS Paint, I think. Yeah. You think? It better be pace boosted at the end. Oh man, if I saw this earlier, I would have played this before. Oh, this is good. Cool. I really like this. The banjo yeah, solo. Mm-hmm. It's very, it's very like atmospheric. Swampy. Yeah. Very swampy. Oh my gosh. It, it feels almost like Diablo-esque. Yeah, that's the strumming now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. The slow background. It's really good. From uh, Not a Cop Johnson, my first song, Ishtar Swamp. I think that guy might be a cop. Uh, he's not a cop. It says it in the name. Uh, this yeah. is his. This is his first song ever. Oh wow! Oh, yeah, nice. Matt. Good job. Yeah. Oh is... yeah. And what a way to spend it. Thank you so much. <laughs> <We're> sorry. <laughs> good shit. That's absolutely That's awesome. Good, That's good shit. All right. Um. Yeah, that's it for now. We'll uh, we'll continue this next week. We're we're definitely, good lord, we are approaching the finale at a very um, rapid lead, pace. Dude. Hey, Hell yeah. Oh, hey, yeah. end of an era, guys. End of an era. Hey, end, end of an era. 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 End of an <laughs> era. Are, we, uh, are we the longest, like technically, like sing- same campaign name and everything campaign you run? Uh, n- I have to check with misdemeanor. How many sessions misdemeanor's done? It'd be you and Misdemeanor that would be. I think Misdemeanor is older because Misdemeanor was right after Arcane Academy. If I Misdemeanor think. also think? has some cursed well, scheduling, which we, which we've lost a, a lot of time on sessions. So I, I genuinely don't know. Uh, well, I'll you have... get back to us with that, Brett, and we're gonna keep this going until we beat them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey. We're, we're yeah. most powerful. All right. Now I'll say that. Human pain. Hey. Human era, dude. Misdemeanor <laughs> is fifty-two sessions. Okay. Yeah. Goblins of Io is 46. Sorry. Oh, oh nice. hell. Yeah, but uh, the quality of those sessions. What was <laughs> yeah, you got to go into the critical <laughs> <of> reception. <laughs> yeah. oh, whatever, whatever. What was the, what was the RT scores on those misdemeanor episodes, Brett? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. As the sole critic that reviews all of the Goblins oh of Io ones, God. we're 10 out of 10. Yeah, oh I, 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 need, I need to know about like what audiences were thinking. What was the control groups like when it yeah, came to like yeah, misdemeanors? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll, uh, when like... I when I get that data, I'll, I'll get back to you. We get, we gotta wait till the end of phase two. Yeah. Thank you. How much is so RP yeah. they got, Brett? No, yeah. It, wait, what? What? Because <laughs> no, no, no. uh, some people, some people yeah, appreciate some people that leave shit. for yeah. the piss RP. So yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Well, that, that's right, I, but... I honestly, honestly, you guys were doing good, but then that piss RP comment just really you broke know what? the. <laughs> it yes. took us a while, Brett. We went through every fetish, but we finally found out that Vor is where we shine. Yeah. 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 Vor and inflation. Yeah. That was yeah. God, I keep going yeah. back yeah. to just how fucking grisly that fucking scene was. It was really I'm going to think about it tonight. We've done while so I play much awful crushing. shit in Goblins, <laughs> you know? and that was the first time I was looking around and I was like, this might have been too far. And <laughs> what, one, too one of my favorite elements of D&D is when a uh, party does a fucked up plan and then the fucked up plan goes off. Off, and then surprise it was fucked up yeah, and then the surprised. and yeah. then the party goes man that was How pretty fucked up that there, there was supposed to be a lot <laughs> to perceive how fucked it was that's what They'll made it fucked it. because the, she starts screaming you know yeah, like, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, i was yeah, like oh yeah 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 that's that's their birthday like you would never do it i think that's my favorite rejected chisel because yeah but that isn't like Clarence <laughs> problem in like I the grand scheme of things. Yeah, know. I don't understand, Jesus, why they disrespected you or Be- why your oath was to kill them. Yeah, yeah, like, there's uh, a lot of I unpacked guess- lore. I guess there's still time. <laughs> we'll unpack it in a thousand years when we emerge from the book. <laughs> you know, I said I would, and I did, and that's it. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, all you need to say. that's done. That's, all you need to that's say. done. Yeah, I said Holy. I revenge, 
And I did. The end. Well, well the end. That's it. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Okay. Wrap this up okay. right now. Oh, well, you guys yep. have a good one. We'll continue this next week with uh, okay. Humans of Io, I guess. Haha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hell yeah. There we go. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Bye. 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 What did you guys think? Y'all have fun. Good sesh. Good sesh. Yes. Like the end? Did you like the end? The, the reveal? That was amazing. Good reveal at the end. Uh, yep, our very talented bird. Uh, I messaged them was like, hey, I need humans of all the goblins. And I was like, you got to keep this secret. And bird was like shaking like, oh, my God. Yeah, I got it. Oh, my God. And uh, yeah, so bird did a very great job. Um, and also uh, chat uh, next week when we're doing the the uh the previous life uh all the displays or all the discord reactions will be the human versions so it should be uh it should be a lot of fun i'm very excited but yeah goblins are wrapping up i think we got bro two three maybe four sessions at most things are getting there so are those animations on youtube you can go ahead and head on over to our discord wow and head on over to our uh our fan art section i would go over there myself but uh where is i'm trying to figure out my chat is this yeah guys head on over to our when's the time skip start uh phase three phase three is gonna happen in 2022 so either in january or february we'll be beginning that i really would like to i don't please brett the warg what about the i don't know what you guys are asking chat Chad, I don't know what you're asking. All of you keep screaming. Some of you keep screaming warg, and I'm like, okay, question mark. The warg, dude, please, please, the warg. You'll find out. Guess you got to watch and find out. Buddies? Brendos? Um, but, uh, yeah. Uh, that's, yeah, 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 yeah. We're not talking phase three right now. What groups are going to be in? Nope, nope. You're going to have to wait. You're going to have to wait, chat. You're going to have to wait. Uh, all the groups are going to be shaken up. There's going to be new new players, new groups. You're just going to have to wait. You're going to have to wait for the IO Direct. That's probably going to happen in January. So, uh, yeah, you're going to have to wait. It'll be, we'll do a Phase 3 reveal, and you're going to have to wait. IO Direct? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to have an IO Direct. So you guys know exactly what Phase 3 is going to be. I know all the uh, all the parties. Yep. Head on over to our Discord if you'd like to go ahead and support uh, the World of IO. Head on over to Patreon, Patreon.com/World of IO. Tomorrow uh, will be the MP uh, on the Patreon, the MP3 of today's session, as well as all the maps uh, that were used uh, for Chief Big Belly's Fort and Day Spa that will also be released, as well as the mechanics uh, for the Chief Big Belly fight that you guys are able to, uh, yeah, if you'd like to run it yourself, all the mechanics and how everything works will also be there on the Discord. So consider support, or on the uh, Patreon, consider supporting the Patreon today. Uh, your support on the Patreon lets me do this for a living. So thank you, thank you, thank you. What was on the unrevealed cards? I guess you're going to have to check out at the Patreon. Ha ha, wow, wowee. IO microtransactions win. Man, I don't know. Never, maybe, sometimes, I don't know. Uh, you can also, if you'd like to go ahead and support, go over to our merch channel, bradultimus.com, where we got uh, the uh, roleplay rack, uh, roleplaying as a fighter, uh, shirts, pins, and prints. New, Some new product is coming soon. Uh, it's going to be a wizard, and that'll be there. So, uh, yeah, should be a lot of fun. If this is your first time watching IO Campaign, welcome. Go over to our YouTube channel. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, watch your VODs over on YouTube for the ad rev. Helps me out tremendously. And join our Discord. Be a part of the community. All right, chat. I am exhausted. Tired. I am done. You guys have a wonderful evening. Thank you to everyone who subscribed, who gifted subscriptions. All the bits cheer. Thank you for all the resubs. I'll be back tomorrow, 7 p.m. EST with Spire of Euclid. See you guys next time. Bye bye.